she has. John Verse, you're here already, bro. <laughs> welcome, welcome, welcome. Feel like feels like it's been a while. I thoroughly enjoyed the stream earlier. It was a lot of fun. Got me through the last few hours of work. I just went, I haven't spoke to you in so long. Uh, no, I'm good. I'm fucking pumped to be playing Manor Lord. Uh, will you see this shit? Fucking, look at this shit. Ha <laughs> ha, yeah. Yeah, I did that. Ha <laughs> ha, welcome in. <laughs> Fuck yeah, I love that shit. That's what I've spent my day doing. Anyway. We're here. Uh, we're ready to rock and roll. Here, check out this poster I got. Can you see that? We're in the shed. Shalom, welcome, Marcus. Arcanade. Did you uh, did you see my transition there? Gotta gotta show you it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, baby. I don't know why there's no uh, image there. That's strange, isn't it? Jeez, insane. <laughs> Thanks, man. Glad you liked it. I am. Um, yeah. All right. Never mind. Uh, let's let's get back to let's get back to chat here. A Uh, so, yes, today we are going to be playing Manor Lord for the first time. Uh, I'm excited. I've not played any of it yet. So, I've just been, I've been waiting. I've had it installed on my, on my PC since 2 o'clock this afternoon. And I've been waiting for this moment. Um, so, that's the plan for today. Oh, yeah. Thank you, brother. I uh, forgot I had that background music up massively loud. Is that better? Uh, anyway, so we're we're back to it. Back to it. Uh, back on Twitch. It's been a while. I had a little test stream the other day, um, which was fun, as always. Uh, just a little test stream just to see how we got on. Played a little flight sim. Uh, sorry, I'm getting messages here. Yeah, just had a little test stream the other day. Um, bit a few few setup changes. We're still in the shed, of course. Uh, where else would I be? We're in the shed, but uh, we're in the shed with a twist. Yo, Dingo, welcome in, brother. Uh, in the shed with a twist um, because now we've got actual walls. So that's that's cool. That's working. Uh, so back in the shed and. Uh, Got lights set up and everything. You can kind of see them behind me. W hold on, where am I? Here. Uh, so the lights will react to what happens on stream. I can control them here as well. Um, but yeah, we uh, got some got a nice little nice little setup. We're we're getting there. We're getting there. We're getting there. Uh, got some tunes on. Uh, this playlist is actually really really nice. I just found it on Spotify. It's called Manor Lords Lufa and Chill. So there we go. Uh, obviously, we'll get the in-game music on once we get started, uh, which I think we should probably do. I think we should probably just jump straight into Manor Lords. Um, so, without any further ado, well, there is a little bit further ado, actually. Let me just turn on the Manor Lords music, pause Spotify. All right. Now, let's play some Manor Lords. <laughs> Oh, 
That never gets old, I love that. Alright, new game. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. What is my name gonna be? I feel like I, uh... Oh, is that loud? It seems like it's loud. Yeah, I just turned down the in-game music. Is that better? What a transition. Thanks, mate. Thanks. Uh, that's what I spent my afternoon doing. So, we're playing Manor Lords. It feels weird to be saying that. Alright, thanks, mate. Yeah, I thought it was a little bit loud. Um, it feels weird to be saying that I'm playing Manor Lords, but here we are. So, I guess I get to pick one of these guys. And I heard that you can... Oh, I don't have a coat of arms. Hold on. I think... Now, bear with me a second. I'm pretty sure there is a Godfrey coat of arms. Let's have a look. Uh, Godfrey coat of arms. I, I heard that you could import a coat of arms. So, let's see what we got here. Godfrey. I think it needs to... It needs to be, like, on a shield. Um... Which obviously those ones aren't, so maybe maybe we don't have a coat of arms. Although I could just import this little this little guy. Uh, although I do prefer the coat of arms, the little man on top. <laughs> just uh, I don't know. I think I I should, probably should have thought about this. Um, but I don't. Know. I don't really have a coat of arms. Like, my family doesn't have a coat of arms. You know what I mean? Some families would. I've got a friend who has, like, a signet ring with, with their coat of arms on it, but... That is not something that I have. Uh, so, no, none of these are going to fit, are they, really? Godfrey, coat of arms. Shield, maybe? Needs an Irish flag. Ah, the Godfrey family's not Irish though, mate. Godfrey is a, I'm pretty sure, an English descent name. Um, I have a lot of, like, Scottish blood in me as well. My uh, great granny's maiden name was McLadry, so pretty sure that's a Scottish surname. Um, and then on my mum's side, her, her granddad was uh, English, so... I'm a, I'm a bit of a mongrel. <laughs> I'm a bit of a mongrel. John Verse loving the fact that I got a lot of Scottish in me. I know you'd love to put some Scottish in me. Jeez, okay. Uh, no, I'm just going to pick one of the ones in the game. I can't be... I, I can't be arsed, to be honest. So, uh, let's get back to it. Okay. Back in the game. Uh, I'm going to pick this wee guy, I think. Oh, no, nah, this, this one looks kind of badass. I like his beard that he's got going on here and his, his turban thing. Um, I need a name. Friedlin. So it's set in Germany, as far as I know. Uh, I say as far as I know. That's all I know. I know, it's, I know we're set in Germany. Um, and is this name... Is it like... Is it supposed to be Hitler? <laughs> Is it supposed to be my first name, or is it supposed to be, uh, like, a surname? Fried Friedling? I don't know. I mean, I have actually, I have actually researched this game. Like, it's not as if I. Uh, I also can't get my mouse off off the game. <laughs> it's just stuck there now. Surname prob? Yeah, family name. All right. Well, let's just go. Godfrey then and uh, load a custom texture no I don't want to do that I'm glad that didn't do anything okay so there's some okay okay let's let's uh let's do like a like a cross so four things that represent the yeah, and I just want to, just a word of warning that, like, playing this game, I am hoping to just kind of be in-depth into it, you know? I don't want to skip across anything. I want to play the game properly and, and get through it. Um, so that's the plan, anyway. 
Uh, okay, yes. So the red and the yellow uh, to... to... Um, what's the word? Represent Ulster. Uh, do we have something like a... What's this? Is this crown? Hmm. That's a better crown. I don't know what any of these symbols mean. Well, let's go... A dragon. Yeah, okay. <laughs> That'll do nicely. Uh, a dragon. And then... What we got here? Some little sperms. That seems to be huge. Ah, uh, there we go. Alright, that's cool. And how do we change the color? Oh, yeah, here. Okay. Give that green for the color of Ireland. No, I don't want to do that. No. Uh. Okay. Nah, I like that one. I think that's quite cool. Uh. I feel like if I'm going to have another animal, it needs to be on the opposite side, you know? Any suggestions, folks? What's this? Is that like a... like a compass? Um... Is that like a... like a poppy? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> it's just... I'm just... like, when I... I'm just doing this, and I'm thinking, I'm going to have to stick with whatever I make here, so it has to be... Semi-decent. Let's go with axe. Why not? Uh, and then bottom left. I don't like this little hut or whatever's going on here. I'm thinking like a castle. Yeah. Let's go with a castle. I'll make it yellow and red. Or maybe like green and blue or something. Oh, green and red. That looks cool. I'll make the background... Well, we'll do these two the same. We'll do those both green and then the other two the same. Yeah. Alright, we'll do it like that. And then I gotta increase the time in there. I gotta do the same number, 3.4. Whoa! I got it exact. That's crazy. So then we need to change the color of this. So maybe we do do it. Um, ha, <laughs> do do. What are blue? Yeah, okay, that looks nice. Uh, on the opposite side then, that shield will make the same colours as well. Blue and red. Cool. Okay. See, I'm already getting into this. Um, I think I did say that I would have free text-to-speech as well. I'll turn that on in a second. Uh, and then the dragon. The dragon will be green. Ah, there's too much green then if I make the dragon green. The dragon will be blue. Blue and white for my, um... Blue and white for my Scottish heritage. And then... Yeah, that's okay, because then these are both blue. Uh, all, this, all the shapes are blue. Yeah, okay. And then this last one, we'll go again with this. Uh, and is it one Thailand? Yeah. And we'll go... Oh... I didn't mean to do that. Uh, red. And yellow. Red and yellow. And then another animal. I think I said I was going to do, didn't I? Uh, we'll go with a... We'll go with a cockerel for an abundance of, of food. We're going to... Hope for an abundance of food. Uh, okay. I think that looks good. This center bit. 
I say we put a cross in as a God-fearing nation. Oh, I got like three crosses. That's quite cool. Okay. Yeah, I like that. Uh, and those crosses are just going to be white. How are you feeling about that? That looks pretty cool, right? <laughs> I think I like that one. Okay. Alright, well, our coat of arms is made. So, we gotta pick our scenarios then. Uh, we don't wanna go... I don't wanna go difficult, like. I'm not... So these templates kind of say how many years of peace we have before um, before we start bringing in raiders. I'm thinking I'm going to go three. The off-map adversary, obviously we want to be present. End goal is domination. Yeah. We've only got the one map because we're in early access. Um, <laughs> zero raider for years, yeah. Yeah, okay. Uh, we'll go our starting season spring. Yeah, that's good. Starting supply standard. Okay, yeah. Balanced approval, medium penalty. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Balanced, yeah. Okay, I think that's kind of like medium difficulty. Which I'm happy enough with. Okay, well, now we're into it. Nice. I agree, brother. Sure is nice. My, uh... Stream Deck app has crashed for some reason. Just want to keep an eye on my CPU temperatures and stuff as well. Uh, how's it, how's it running? Okay, I think I got a new message. Now, why can't you see what? Why can't you see the graphics? Why can't why can't you see it? Uh, I don't think I I don't know if there's a tutorial to be honest. Um, no, there's, I don't know what's going on here. Ah, uh, give me a wee sack. Technical difficulties, folks. They seem to follow me. This is so strange. Why can't I seem to stream this? Ah, oh, there we go. Okay. Now we're in it. Now we're in it. A new message. Build up your town your manor, and when ready, press claims towards regions owned by your opponents. Once a claim has been pressed, be ready for battle. I am ready. I feel like Spongebob about to go for his promotion. In Manor Lords, families need food and fuel and roof above their heads to survive. I think there should be an A ah there and a ah roof. Anyway. Supplies in the region panel above shows how much you've got left. <laughs> I can't see underneath my camera; it's just on the top of my, on the top of my screen. Uh, okay, supplies in the region. I, I assume this is the region panel. Um. Oh, this is this is all the region panel. Okay. 
So, 8 timber, 20 stone, 10 tools. We got some food, we got some fuel. Rich deposit of stone over there. Got a clay deposit here and an iron deposit. Now, that is not happening tonight, <laughs> I can't imagine. Uh, and this is our little camp. So, got it. Okay. We have some homelessness goes on, going on. We've got exposed goods. And more exposed goods. Yeah, map's massive. And this is only the first map. I mean, from what I know, there's going to be multiple maps. Um, in the future. This view shows you which regions are under whose control. You can press claim to other regions when you gain enough influence. Okay, got it. I can use the... Okay. Berry deposit here. Okay, that's good. So we spawn next to a berry deposit. That is some food. Uh, going forwards at least. Um, I can rotate. Ah, uh, okay. Nice. Okay, we got it. 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 Settings, help, army, construction, roads. How can I check where, like, the deposits are? Year one. Okay, what, what, where is my current, it just says spring, but how do I know what month it is? In almost all cases, resources, spam resources, yeah. Resources have to be physically moved. It can take a moment, so feel free to change game speed. Okay. So this hitching post then, I feel like I need to assign a family to that. Okay. So, I've got a family assigned to the hitching post now. Um, we've got some supplies over here. Uh, still homeless. Okay. Here we are. Where are my people? Hello, sir. No, stop turning around. I'm trying to see your face. <laughs> Looks a little bit like me. Can I run? It's just kind of plopped me in the middle of a road. I don't know where my... Ah. So this is the current time. This is what we're working... This is what we're starting with. Okay, these are our people. These are our times, people. Hey, oh. We can see we got an ox here. Summer's coming soon. Summer's coming soon. There is a third person mode, yeah. Um, it's kind of just a cosmetic mode. <laughs> look like Santa. <laughs> yeah. It's kind of, from what I've heard, it's just like a cosmetic mode at the minute. There's not really a lot to it. Um, but you can do it. Lord Santa. Right, now what? <laughs> what do I do? Help. Okay. Families, buildings, resources. That's what I need. Manor Lords, Arknade, Dubstep, Christmas Remix. <laughs> <laughs> Go chop some trees. Yeah. How do I get out of this? Uh, how do I do that though? How do I build? How do I build things? Where's? Okay, here we go. Every region of Manor Lords has strengths and weaknesses. Make sure to check the resource deposits as well as investigate the soil fertility before deciding on the direction of your town. If your region has weak fertility, consider setting up trade early. Got it. No. The thing is, I don't know where our adversary sits. Um, 
So there is an AI adversary that you will be battling. Uh, they don't come through. So they're not going to come through until like the third year. Raiders aren't going to come through anyway. Yeah, I think I can select the people. Um, okay, there's outlaws here. So we're pretty close to them. That's uh, slightly worrying. Where, where are my people? Over here. Uh, yeah, I think I can select them. Mm. Okay, maybe not. Uh, okay, he's an ox handler. I don't think any of the supplies need moving yet, so... I just need to... I just kind of need to build something. Feel like I need to build a road into our little clearing. Let's see where the underground. Ah, oh, we're right on top of water as well. Perfect. So we're right on top of water. That's good because obviously we need water. Oh, I got a new message. I have heard of your renown. I only seek to defend my rights and my honor against those who would wrong me. I hope you will not judge me by my, by the room by the rumors and slanders that some may spread about me. Sign and sealed by my own seal, Hildebolt von Berenreuth. Right back. Uh, what? Oh, okay. Uh, I can't say that. I can say this, though. Do, do I do this? Am I going to die? I don't know. Um, I feel like this is... I feel like that would be setting myself up for failure if I if I send him a message. Well, it's currently March, and we're still in spring. Uh, so I don't know how long a year lasts in minutes, to be honest. I mean, I have watched quite a few videos on this before playing it, and I've been following the development for years, but that's actually something I don't know. Anyway, let's get into it. All right, uh... Right, let's let's upgrade the camp. Yeah, an hour thirty minutes. I I imagine it's something like that. Alright, timber timber requires oxen to be moved. Villagers will automatically get the ox when they need it. Got it. Right, there we go. Okay, now now we're doing something. To get more population you need to have enough empty burgage plots and your approval needs to be over fifty. Right. So here's the thing, like, do we, what I, we don't need to start building burgage plots right away. What I do need is, like a woodcutter's lodge. Workers fell trees nearby to produce firewood. No, I need timber. So I think the first thing I need to do is a logging camp. Uh... Hold on, how much? I got seven timber. So if I use all my timber before I get started, that wouldn't be so good. Um, some workplaces allow villagers to use hand carts to transport up to ten goods at once. Uh, so make sure to connect your buildings to roads. Okay, that's fine. All right, let's get this. Let's get this logging camp built. I don't know where the front of it is. I doubt it matters. Uh, and I reckon I, I reckon just stick it here. I can always move it, I think. So, underground water is here. So we need a well at some point as well. We need a well as well. Stonecutter camp. Uh... Granary. 
Mary Storehouse. Where's the wells? Okay. What about food? Yeah, what about food? That's a good question. I need... How do I get a family to start foraging? Must be a way to click on these people. I will right, let them finish the log and come first. But what I do need to figure out is how do I get some food? So there will be one of these that allows me for foraging. There'll be like a um I don't really know like some sort of foraging camp. Right, there's a hunting camp. Ah, forager hut. There we go. Okay. So I'm going to need one of these. Uh, and the berries are kind of out here. But I I feel like that's too far. So maybe if I just kind of... If I put it here and then build a road to it, that might work. I don't really know. Select it and assign a family. Cool. How do I rotate it? While human workforce has to be assigned by default, livestock workforce is shared between workplaces. However, you can bind it to a workplace in the advanced tab. Just watch out so that you have unassigned oxen if you have any construction going on. <laughs> uh, I just seen the message from Mave. Uh, thank you. Sick transition. The, the crowd went wild. I'm, I'm glad you went wild. I appreciate that. Okay, so, um, let's get this forager hut built while it's still spring. Uh, we'll put it here, and then we can, we can build a road down this way. That's, that's pretty easy. Looks like there's berries and stuff right over there, so. Yeah, the workers just start working. I have to assign a family to this specific plot. But anyone that's not assigned to a job currently will now come and start building this if they haven't started already. So what I got to do is I've obviously got my logging camp. Um, and they're going to start logging. Uh, so I only assigned two families here. And then I'm going to build a road from here. And how do I... Road curvature. Come on, Come on. Why the road? Um, because I need a road for the oxen to travel along. Um, so if the oxen and and has a road, if the oxen have a road, then it makes them easier. Yeah, it makes it faster. That's exactly what I was trying to say. Sorry. Just talking gibberish, like. So, where's the. Is that the hitching post there? I don't know. I don't understand that curvature thing. Oh, uh, okay. Aha, uh -huh. gotcha. Right. So what I actually need to do... Well, no. Uh, no reason why I just can't go straight, is there? Alright, there's, there's a road. 
and then we'll go from the road. Uh, hold on. We go from is this is this like a big hill here? Forager hut is finished. Okay, let's immediately get a family onto that. How many families do I have? Where do I see, fucking hell? Where do I see that? <laughs> Yeah, pretty much, yeah. Build a wall around it. Um, I mean, I think the forager hut... This is kind of very primitive. Eventually the forager hut will be gone because I'll have, a, I'll have like, farming. But I think it takes a few years for farming. Five families. My approval's low. Okay, I got five families, so one to foraging. Let's see, two to foraging. One for the one to look after the ox. And then, yeah, okay. So everyone's got a job now. Right. Everyone's assigned. Everyone's got a job. Okay, so... I I do actually need to build that road from the road. So let's... Go here. Build that. And then we'll go from here... To here. Build that. And then I think I'll just put a little road around here like this to here. Right, we got some roads now, uh, albeit they're they're primitive, but they should work. And how are foragers getting on? Okay, we've got four berries. It is still March, yeah. Yeah, that is the thing. I don't really know. I don't know how fast time is going here. I think I need to just visit. <laughs> See. <laughs> wow. Okay. So here's our forester hut. I wish I could like speak to these people. That will be fun, wouldn't it? Okay, that's cool. Doesn't this game just look great? This is made by one fucking guy. It's made by one guy, like... Isn't that... Isn't that mad? It is mad, like... One guy. Also, just gonna get rid of these for now. I don't, I don't need them. Sort of. Okay. I'm lost. Where's my... Don't know how I ended up over there. So we do have a small little camp now. Um... Worker camps refueled. So now I need to... I think I need to, like, build some shelter for... My berries, maybe? Granary. Distribute goods using the pantry. Storage. 
storehouse. Okay, let's build a storehouse then. Uh, and I'm just gonna just gonna put it along the main road here. I think if I actually put it beside the camp on the road into town, or in, into town. Well, yeah, I guess I guess we are heading into town now. Uh, okay, we'll put a store there, and then maybe one over here. Um, but the thing is, because everyone's assigned, no one is going to build it. Build it? Build it. We also got to have a look here for, in terms of fertility. Ain't much good for farming here. I wish I could zoom the whole way out and still see that. Uh, but we can grow rye quite nearby actually see these fields over here and if we move down here to the to the um i was gonna say west but i don't know which way's which move down here to the left anyway we can do that too um so okay we're getting somewhere now uh storehouse don't need that Going to build another hitching post. Just next to this well. I'll build one next to the logging camp because they're the guys that are going to need it most, really. Okay, so now I've got that all set to build. I need to unassign a family uh, from somewhere. So, I'm just going to unassign one of my foragers. How are we doing for food? Not too bad. We're okay. At the moment. Ah, I, just got my, I just got my car back today. It's just uh, a good time. Alright, let's fast forward a little bit. Until everything built at least. Here, do you mind not having a wee chat? Like, we got stuff to do. <laughs> Alright. Construction finished. I can't, uh... I don't think I can afford another... Ox yet. Alright, we've got two storehouses and another hitching post. We can go back to normal speed now. We're in April. Um, so I think the goal is probably to have some burgage plots ready by the winter. Now we need to get some more people to move in by summer actually, so... I gotta... I've, I've definitely got to get some of these burgage... burgage you know what I mean. Gotta get some of those in by the... But we still have people foraging. Pantry's almost full. If you if you have just tuned in, hello, welcome to Manor Lords. Um, feel free to say hello. I will get the I'll get the text to speech on. Actually, I did promise that. Aaron Godfrey changed the lights to green. Please wait. Oh no. Aaron Godfrey changed the oh, lights no. to red. Please wait. Aaron. It's, uh, it's, it's going through everything that has been said in the chat. I don't know how to skip all that. I don't know why. I don't know why it's doing that. 
I just had to mute it. Hold on. That's badass. Shalom. Jackie. Jeez. Insane. Background music is quite loud. Nice. Hell yeah. Chi. What a transition. Do it <laughs> is quite loud. That is better. Pause champ. Needs an Irish flag. Poggers. Jeez. D. Pog champ. Hitler. L U L. <laughs> Hitler. Family name. <laughs> Surname prog. Looks all right to me. Saucy. Zero. Nice. Is there no tutorial? Think my PC just froze lol. Can see it now. Maps massive. If you just joined, this Spam is a recap resources. of the whole chat. <laughs> Jeez, the there's so first far. person made. Third. <laughs> Looked like Santa. I don't know how to Lul. skip it. Ha ha ho. Did that say homeless Shetler lol? Manor Lord's Ark Nade Dubstep Christmas Remix. Gee, was a transition Go chop would some be perfect trees. for a tune. A Jan verse sheesh. Can you select the people? It would be. How long does a year last in minutes? I'd guess an hour. Or 30 minutes. WB food. Do the workers just starting working themselves? Why the road? Is it faster? Is the idea to build all this and then build a wall around it? So or build questions. a castle nearby? <laughs> 15. A top. W. It's still March lol. Wood supply 52. LUL. LMAO. Chi was a transition would be perfect for a tune. Ha. LUL. All right. Well, uh, I'm glad we got, we got that out of the way. Uh, okay, it's raining. Armory, don't need anything there. I think I should... Do I start building homes now? I can't really do much else until I get more families, can I? I read TTS messages and I'm a little bitch. <laughs> Foundry is full. I need a granary. For fuck's sake. I wish that was a bit more obvious. Right, I'll put a granary next to... That's used 10 of my stone. That's used my last 10 stone. Right. How do I get more stone? Ah, oh, have I fucked it? I, I feel like I need a, a stone cutter camp as well. If I just build one here, let's let's hope that someone can do something with it. Because I'm gonna need, I'm. Definitely gonna need stone as well. <clears throat> Let's see. <laughs> we'll see what happens. I don't. I don't really know. I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, just a little, a little check on the old phone. Saving finished. Thank you. Okay. Exposed stocks are getting soaked. What? Will that store my wood? Advanced. Right. So it that so it can't store food, but it can store crops and it can store pretty much everything else. Gotcha. Okay, people, well, let's get everything. I don't have an unassigned family. Fucking hell, right? Well, the pantry's full anyway, so. I need a beer. That's what I need. Anyway, how are y'all doing tonight? <clears throat> Welcome to the stream, if you just tuned in. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Uh, right. I've now got people constructing stuff. We got some wood in, in storage, that's good. 
Um, currently showing surplus goods. Okay, so this is this is surplus. That's total. Right. Okay. It's currently showing surplus. Uh, one on a sign family. I kind of need another family. Fifty percent approval. One hundred percent public order. Regional wealth is fifty. Do I? I feel like I should buy another ox. Orders can be placed once a month. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I was just, <laughs> just making sure I had that enabled. Because uh, I will need to go pay at some point. I am... Um I have the bladder of a of a child. Um, sorry, I'm just adding it to my hot cues. In game. Friday night beverages. Friday night beverages. Well, I have a couple of beers in the fridge, and I've also got a we um a wee bottle of vodka I bought last night that I had a couple of. So, yes, there will be some Friday night beverages taking place in the shed. Uh, which looks great, by the way. Eyes. Sheds look good. Got these posters to put up on the wall here. Um, kind of like back corner over here. You'll be able to see them. They'll look, it'll look pretty cool. Uh, I also need to get it plastered and painted. But, you know, one thing at a time, I guess. Uh, yeah, do you know what? I am going to get a beverage very soon. But uh, we'll, we'll play for a bit longer. So, let's just fast forward a little bit. Simon. Simon. Selector. Ha ha ha. <laughs> Run that back. Yes, Come on. These, these tunes. Suey. 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 For when I uh when I do a DJ stream as well in the e future. E these lights have a pretty good Two jokes. sound setting. They have a pretty good music setting that like reacts to the music that's played. Uh right, let's get everything all constructed. What well, Still don't have a new ox. Still not here yet. When the merchant comes with my ox, that'll be the... Uh... Here we go. Here he comes. Wow. New ox. Drum and bass is massive by Arknade out now on Spotify. New Ox who dis. Yeah, speaking of that. Uh -huh. New York, speaking of that New York Nade tune, it is a banger. It is a banger. Jeez. Okay. Sheesh. Jeez. Medieval DNB. This makes me want to like. Gonna start. make the workers work faster. Let's go. Speed off them. Song ID in the corner. Get it out of your playlist. The final 174 Arcane. workers per minute. <laughs> I 
LMAO. <laughs> I got two oxes now, so that's positive. I think the next thing to do, I need to build some houses. I got this stone cutter camp, but I've got no one in it. But is everything is everything built? Okay, everything's built. So let's get people cutting stone. Jeez. Civil defense officials in Nottingham have just found this out now. Have told newsmen that trouble is possible. Uh. Drop the art nade emotes, I haven't seen them in long. Ah, I don't have any art nade. Show me some emotes, bro. I don't know if I have that, like, emote explosion thing. He must. Art nad bad boy banger art nad im dun art nad sassy art nad om cat dj art Jeez. nad you mad bro art nad wheel up art nad pure heat art nad arc raid art nad bass face art nad gian <laughs> arong 22 pull that 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 simon oh no art nad gian arc nad gian arc nad gian Jeez. Okay. Seaman a ha. Do you know what though? I, if I, I, I think I'll probably upload these to YouTube. If, if I wasn't going to upload these to YouTube, I would have that fucking drum and bass pumping. Uh, instead, we're going to have to go with the in game music. Uh, but that's okay, because we're, we're chilling. It's nice chill music. It's Can like you a... take the TTS out for YT? No, I cannot. I Actually, I can, but it's just effort, I think. So maybe maybe I'd have to take the TTS off. I don't know. There is a way to do it. Um, I'm gonna pillage Uranus. <laughs> Saving finished. Ha ha. FFS. I turned on personality voice, so now everyone's got a. Everyone's voice has a personality. Okay, that should do the job. How's the game? Had to deep for a bit. Yeah, the game's good. It's uh it's just very chill, man. Um I'll show you what we've got so far, so Nice accent. Got our logging camp. These guys are are gathering wood. Uh, storehouse here. We got our worker camp for the homeless. Um, everyone's homeless at the moment. Got a uh, one ox here, another ox here. Um, we got a stone cutter Deep camp. For <laughs> uh, granary, which is going to be housing our berries. Great accent. Uh, and the pantry. Uh, I don't know how to move the berries to the store granary. I need to assign a family. So, I got plenty of wood so we can stop the log cutters. And uh, we'll get someone assigned to the granary. We've got someone assigned to the stone cutting as well. Not that they seem to be doing anything.
see. Who have we got? One on a sign. Stone cutter. Oh, he's got the stones. Yes, let's go. Badass. Alright. Okay, they want a market. Well, I think I think I need to build some housing first before I start thinking about a market. So I think maybe if we try and have like a town square kind of thing here. I don't think I don't think I can move this. Or do I have like district of work there no because I think I read that okay let's let's just start by building some housing here yeah I think that makes sense um because there's no fertility there either smell <laughs> work in progress it's, uh, it's the joy of a early access game. Um, Smell the Erma. <laughs> Amazing. Uh. Yeah, uh, I don't know how to, if I was to upload this to YouTube, I don't know how to, um, oh well, we'll see, we'll see what happens. Ah, oh, it's starting to rain. Okay, let's get these burgage plots built then, because I need more families, it's May, we're about to hit the summer. Uh, gathering, mining, residential. Burgage plot level one. Okay, here we go. We need this tutorial. Some buildings have flexible borders. Place four points to designate an area. The cursor will snap to roads and buildings to try and create an organic shape. You can leave more space for future uh, with upgrades. So they go to the George back. <laughs> it's in Germany, mate. So uh, probably Protestant. Um, you can leave more space for the future. First two points mark the front of the house by default. Got it. Eje. <laughs> so. They say in the tutorials and videos that I've watched, they say it's good to have people's houses close to their place of work. So. How many can we build here? Um, how deep do they need to go, like? I can fit five in here. I've got five families. Okay. Well, they're under construction now. Um, I've only got one nice. unassigned family. So... Let's see, what is everyone doing? What a warn my head. I don't know what's going on here. Tra uh, granary worker, right, of course. I put someone in the granary, didn't I? I got someone in the stone workers. How much stone have I got now? <laughs> I just I can't remember where to look for things. Fuel. 
Uh, construction, right. We got 13 stone. Okay. Oh. Storehouse, no one working there. Granary. So, are they almost... They're almost done transporting. Uh... And I love this, that you can, I mean, you can really see, you know, they're building here, like, it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool, yeah. Just watching the construction, just... <laughs> Man, I, I, every time, like, I just can't believe this game was made by one guy. What, like... Love what team de construction. Yeah, it's sick, isn't it? I think it's one of the best parts. Does, does, is that, does that sound stupid? It's, it's definitely one of my favorite parts, just watching the construction. It's just so cool. I mean, it's piece by piece. It really is piece by piece. It's class. Really cool. Like, a, just a really good touch. I feel like when when it comes to a game and uh, you see, like, you see the game, you know, when it comes to, it's like, a simulation kind of city building game like this and, and the buildings get built, built bit by bit, that's kind of just like, you know, the fundamental sign of a, of a good game that has had a lot of love and effort put into it. And uh, I, th I really think that's what we're seeing here. I mean, this guy, I was I was happy to buy this game, you know? A lot of times I, when it comes to buying a game, I, I just, I'm just not happy to pay the money uh, because it's coming, it's going to big corporations that don't really care about their audience. All they care about is making a quick couple of quid. Do you know what I mean? Uh, EA, I'm looking at you, you cunts. Um, so, when it comes to something like this, and it's made by one guy, and it is a passion project, I am so happy to buy this game. It was only £25. Why wouldn't I? Why wouldn't I? It's on Game Pass, yeah, sure, but he doesn't get as much money from Game Pass as you would get if I buy it, I think. I don't know. I don't really know. But, uh, I just, I was just, I'm just more than happy to buy a game for possibly the first time in my life. Um, and maybe, maybe I will buy another copy. I would like to do a giveaway. Why is your guy not genius? Oh, man, he is a blonde, like. But, uh, strawberry blonde? I don't know. Welcome in, George, by the way. Thanks for joining us. Hi. Hi. So, um, I think I get to destroy this camp pretty soon. And I've got to build a well, also. Homeless will move to the plot, and if approval is high enough, it might attract new families too. However, I am inserting myself into your portion of the UCA shortly. You are! I'm looking forward to seeing you, buddy. Um, Dingo, you remember George Warren, don't you? G Warren, 36. Uh, all we need is Matt Matt Joe in here now to complete the original gang. <laughs> the lockdown gang. Feels okay, man. Feels okay, yeah. I guess you could say that. Okay, back to it. Let's, uh, Wrong gang. Wrong gang. Yeah, boy. And don't forget, if you have Amazon Prime, you could you get one free Twitch subscription. Uh, per month. Just just to throw that out there, I'm not... No, I'm kidding. Uh, sun's out again. 
We must be at like the tail end of May now. And I think we should build a well next. Just. Whoa, settlement level increased. Let's go. Let's friggin' go. I love that. I love Soon that. Soon South much. Skin Cancer Buffing coming. Soon South Skin Cancer Buffing so coming. Sub. Sub. Uh, yeah, where do we build a well? It has to be built on water. Probably just here, next to the road. I'll do. New message. A strong militia is paramount to the survival of any settlement. Luckily, a shipment of weapons has just arrived. And you will now be able to create your first militia banners to serve you and protect your people. However, we will need more weapons to equip all the people as the settlement grows, either by making them or importing them from other lands. Okay, now we're getting to the reason. Now we're getting to the reason. So let's see about constructing a backyard extension here. Um, or where was my wealth? Up here. My regional wealth is 30. Planning permission required first. Okay, well let's not do that then. What I do need to build is a... Uh... I can't remember what I was going to say. How do I get how do I get these people moved into the burgage plots? They're all empty. They're finished, but they're empty. Should I just Build destroy house. this? If you're homeless. Well, they should be homeless now. Okay, one family in there, family in there, family in there. Fa oh, I've got a new family. Unreal. Do you think I can fit another little burgage plot in here? So I just like... Let's see, next to the well. Well, well, well. No space for an extension on this one. Do I maybe make it smaller then? I'll do. All right, now we've got a little, uh, we got a little village, more or less. Nusloge genetic pool smaller than Norwegian. Looking good. George, what did you just try to say there, bro? Nus. Nusloge. <laughs> just the way, just the way the guy, my, my text to speech guy started chatting there. <laughs> That's funny. It's the name of our village. Look at the top. Oh yeah, this low high. Yeah, sorry, I can't see that. My it, it's hidden behind my camera. Um. Nusloje feels dank man. Nusloje. Okay, well, here we are. First part is done. I think, 
I think it would probably be pretty important when to get... you unlock nooks. When you unlock nooks. Don't know, uh, don't know what point that happens. Um, I need to. I need a way to make money. So the reason why I was thinking... I'm going to relocate that over here. So I think we could build a little square here. And by square, I mean... I think I will put the mar the first bit of the market here. So you come in, you got a square here where the market will be. I can't move that supplies, can I? It's just kind of there. Okay. Oh well. It's got to stay where it is. Uh, marketplace, right. So, I'm going to build a market here. How big do we make it? Jeez, I don't need 63 market stalls. Okay, so these are blocking my my square. Alright, well. Let's just build it here and then build a... We'll just build a road to it. Why do I have to carry this alone? A well supplied marketplace is the lifeblood of your town. Assigned families will set up stalls automatically as long as there is enough space on the market. Hover over specific categories to check your current supply and demand. Burgage plots closest to the market get their requirements fulfilled first. Got it. Alright, those hitching posts are all good. Okay, we've we've got six families. Uh, we don't have anyone foraging at the moment, so let's get back on that while it's still summer. Um, what's this telling me? Generic storage full. Uh, I don't have anyone logging at the moment, but we still got quite a surplus of logs. We've got water access. And uh, w one thing I need to do to really make the people happy is build a church from what I've heard. I gotta build a church. That's um Build a road to the market. So we got stalls. Uh, via a tax policy. Right, we got two months until supplies run out. Uh, I got nine months of fuel, but only two months of food. So I think by this logging camp, I probably need to build... Run out of fuel. Okay. I need a woodcutter's lodge as well, I think. Um, how do I turn... How do I rotate? Okay, Woodcutter's Lodge there. Uh, we need to get one family back in to collect in logs. Jeez, okay, what's going on here? Um, 
Uh, these are just my notifications. Running out of fuel. Okay, yeah. I know I'm running out of fuel. How do I make planks? Let's create a save as well. Nice low A. Okay. So everyone's got a home. Come on, laddie. So population is 18, we've got 6 families here, that's good. Uh, we've got our marketplace, they've got food in there. So we're still running low on fuel, I think I need maybe... Construction priority is very high. Let's get that finished. Alright. Get to work. Get to work. Um. Yeah, okay. How are we enjoying the stream so far, folks? Am I uh, am I doing Manor Lords justice? I hate watching those. The streams. soundtrack is nice guitar time. It is nice guitar time, isn't it? Um, yeah, the music so f I quite like the music. It's been it's been pretty nice. I did turn the volume down a little bit because it was quite loud, but I turned it up a bit. Um, how are we enjoying it though? I'm I'm liking it so far. What's it like to watch? Because I have watched a few streams, and to be honest, I enjoyed. Um, I did enjoy watching people streaming this. So, uh, hopefully, you're enjoying the stream so far. Um, if you got any suggestions or tips, I'm all ears. Almost run out of fuel. Check the supplies tooltip. I am trying to get some more fuel. Do I need to? I've only got six families though. One family on here, one family on here, one family on here. Obviously I need someone collecting food. So Really I need I need another family moved in. Hey, my approval rating just went up. Come on! It's the little wins. It's the little wins. Come on. Jeez, my PC didn't like that, did it? <laughs> that was too much for my CPU. It's screaming now. It's no dog type bar. Anyway, that was just for me to cheer for the uh back to back to the game. Audio getting deep fried. Back to it. Sweet. Uh, see. So approval written's up, that's positive. We, we just need it. we need to get another family in. Still running out of fuel. We've had one more new firewood, but it's it's not really enough, like. And I got one family in the logging camp. What are they doing? Wait waiting on what?
Guys, what are you waiting on? What are you waiting on? Is it because I got no one set? What are they doing? Each other. <laughs> yeah, it seems that way, doesn't it? So, as soon as I unassign them, they decide to leave their house. Right, okay, nice. It's no wonder that we're about to run out of fuel because no one's collecting wood. Okay, so we've got two months of supplies. Uh, it's still June. Let's fast forward a little bit, see where we get to here. Thoughts so far? My thoughts so far are I am thoroughly enjoying it, actually. Um, it's pretty cool. What about you? I'm very eager to know the thoughts of you guys watching. Um, what do you what do you think so far? Same still. Same chill. Yeah, it is. It is very chill. A slow pace. Slow paced. Yeah. Slow. A slow pace. Yeah, no, very slow paced. But that's kind of. I mean, that's what I wanted. That's what I was hoping for. Just slow paced, very chill, something that I can just hop on here and stream for hours playing. Um, you know, it's the first day that it's out, so... I wonder if I made a mistake by deleting that camp. No one else has joined my town recently. Uh, but yeah, uh, so I'm enjoying playing it, but are you guys enjoying watching it? That's, that's what I want to know. Because um, I'm only going to stream it if it's enjoyable to watch. Now we got light. Uh, but I, I hope, I hope it is enjoyable to watch. Okay, I feel like we're out of the woods in terms of um, firewood, so I'm gonna skip forward a little bit. Mercenaries companies available. Hire mercenaries. Local thugs. See, I don't have any money in the treasury. I don't know how to do that. Let's see. Economy. Treasury. How do I how do I do taxes? Tax office. 
Prismatic only. Okay. I still don't. I still don't know. Okay. Well, it's it's just not in there yet, so. I don't know, to be honest. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. We'll get there. The regional wealth is still quite low. We got three months of supplies. Oh, okay. Okay. Specialize your region. So each region, I think you get six of these points per region. So it's not like... It's not like this is something that you can just have free reign with also we gotta remember it's early access so not all the development tree parts are available these are all work in progress locked in early access work in progress locked in early access but we do have some stuff available to us now so after you reach the next settlement level you will be granted a development point to spend unlock development branches to make your region more efficient to pardon me to enact policies, you need to rise your administration level by building administrative buildings like the manor. Ah, so... Guitar time. <laughs> Guitar break. Uh, okay. So, after you reach the next settlement level, you'll be granted a development point. Um, okay. So what have we got? Armor making. Charcoal burning. So I need two, two level two burgage plots to progress to the next level. Foreign suppliers, permanent market stall, which provides a passive income of firewood. Whoa. As long as the region has enough regional wealth, region does not pay the transport fee must be placed on the marketplace uh food cart so we've got heavy ply um at a plowing station enables employing oxen at the farmhouse but for significantly faster plowing of large fields as well as bringing crops back to storage more efficiently we've got sheep breeding Sheep grazing on the pasture, slowly multiply. Ah, oh, that might be a good one. But, but obviously not for right now. And then... Produces apples. Okay. Uh, doubles capacity of berries. Beekeeping. Workers collect honey. Good one, clap dos. <laughs> I actually don't know. What do you got? What do you th what do you reckon is going to be helpful here? We're in July. I, all I'm thinking is we're going to have to build a hunter's lodge pretty soon. Um. We'll have to build a hunter's lodge pretty soon because when it gets to winter, there's no berries. But I, I feel like that is not yet. Well, it's it is not yet. Um, I got another few months until I need to do that. In winter, in winter, seasonal resources are gone. Firewood doubles. Okay, so there has there there has to come a point where I literally just assign everyone to firewood, apart from the people that are foraging, maybe. Because oh, I still only got three months worth of firewood. I definitely need to get more people. One there, one there. 
Where are the rest of my families? That's three. Four. Okay, I think we I think the stone cutters can come away from there for Alright, we got one foragers. Okay, we'll, we'll get one extra log in. Um, well, actually, I can't... I can't hold any more logs. My log storage is full. So I can't store the firewood in there. So I can still have one family maybe on stone cutting. Oh no wait, I can't. One, two, three, four, five, six, yeah. Okay. Let's see how much firewood we can get here in the next month. Berries are running a little bit low, but uh, they are seasonal of course, so it's always going to happen. Still got enough logs. So, uh, maybe, so timber and firewood's different then. Okay, now that's good. Firewood is getting done. And the good thing is they're also clearing these trees, which is good because when it gets to that time, um, we want to start farming. Uh, we got some barley fertility here. We got loads of rye fertility around here, which is great. Um, so that's good. We can build a we can build a farm there. So I think I'm gonna move this. Hmm. Where to? Never mind. I'm just trying to think where I can build the next burgage plots. I don't know. Timber. I think if I need more, if I want more logs, I need another logging camp. 
is pretty much the situation there. I also don't need this storehouse. Nothing in it. So there's no way to prioritize these supplies. What I have heard is they can be moved around. So if I... I'm wondering then, because these are going to get wet now. It's only two logs. But those supplies that are lying about from the places that I demolished before. Are these the same people that went home last time? <laughs> Lazy buggers. What are you waiting on? I don't know what they're waiting on. It's disconnected from the road network. Well, let's fix that. Sorry, like, but abandoned camp. Rain time, up, up, Ustaha, rain time. are done. I repeat, berries are done. I don't know where the bandit camp is. Resource stolen by the nearby bandits. That's where I need my hunters, but that's too far away. So, um... I think I will build a little hunting cabin, though, next to the forager hut. We all know what that means, huh? Do we all know what that means, pal? Farming... Okay, we're not we're not up to that point yet. I do wish there was a little bit more tutorial going on here. Those supplies are still sat there. Harvest season has started. We should have enough fuel for 18 months. We got enough food as well. If we can make it through the first winter.
Alright, we need to start hunting, I think. Whoa, we got some bread. Um, I think we could probably build another burger plot now as well. Just out the back, just round here, just a little road round. Or do we... Let me check the fertility here. So there's water there. But they need to be close to the market as well, because they need to be able to gather their supplies, don't they? So... I'm thinking I could fit two here. Those supplies are just really, fu really fucking in my way. I don't know how to get rid of them. Right, we got to we got to do this because I will I want some more people to move in cuz I need some more workers. So uh let's build two more burgage plots. And I, I don't think hmm, let's see. Yeah, that's that's really in my way. That's a real pain in the arse like. I probably can't build two here, maybe just one. Hmm. Well, building so in depth. Yeah, I know, right? It really is in depth, uh, and I I like it. This is like this game. This is what I wanted. You know, this is just what I've needed. I, uh, I've been saying a lot recently, it's like, I don't have a game to properly sink my teeth into at the moment. Well, I think my prayers have been answered. But we'll see. We'll not, uh, Sweet. we'll not get ahead of ourselves, but, you know, this is really good. Can I just relocate this somewhere a little bit out of the way? Take one of these woodcut families just to do a little bit of building. Get that built. Is no one going to take... Has this bugged out a little bit here? This hmm.
so they have had to go out to these wild animals way over here to do some hunting. Which is fair, like I kind of expected it, but... Yeah, I've already been playing this for like over an hour. Right, that hitching post is finished. But that ox is still not... It's still not there. But why? I did say I needed to... I did... I did knock down one of my storehouses, so I should probably build another one. That one's full. Um... If I... Kind of... I'll just build it next to it. Okay, I do have unassigned families to do that. Let's get another one on wood cutting. Okay, those supplies have gone now. Happy days. Alright, now we can get the burgage plots in there. Um, where are we? Residential. Okay, we can fit three in there. I'll do. Nice. Okay. Let's see if we can get some more families moved in then. Um. I'm wondering, do I need to get another family out hunting? What's, why is he just waiting? Barbara, get out. Go do some work. What are you waiting on? <coughs> Did they... Hey, right, okay, they've... They've been successful. Why is it saying I don't have enough stable space? Can I upgrade this to a stable? I need wooden planks. Right, well, how do I do that then? Well, this is quite in-depth, isn't it? So now I need to figure out how to make planks. Not mining. Industry. Leather. Build a saw pit as well. Um, this is like our little industrial part of town.
Right, we're in October. We're nearly at the winter. That's kind of kind of scary. Well, we'll see what happens once we get to the winter. Uh, I am still curious, you know, how does this transfer across to to watch enjoyment? Is it... It's snow. Snow, yeah, it will snow. <laughs> um, uh, uh, yeah, what's, what's, it, what's it like watching, watching this? Is it boring or is it like the kind of thing that you want to just... I don't know. Have a little smoke and chill out and watch. I mean, obviously, you, you wouldn't watch this if you want to watch something super engaging. But I feel like watching this, I can I could get very into it, even if it's not me playing it. You know, just watching someone else play it. It's nice stream content. Thank you. Uh, I'm glad. That's what I was hoping for, like. Right, three new houses. Still no new families, but that's okay. Let's get someone creating some... Do you need one family doing some logging? Hey, a new family! Come on! Let's go! Ba 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 bum! I wish I, I need like a. I need a soundboard that does like, woohoo! I don't have that. Something like that. <laughs> Stocks damaged by weather, storehouse. Got some planks now. It's November, winter is coming. We've got a new family that are unassigned. That's good. It's good to have uh, an actual little unassigned family. Um, and we can upgrade this to a small stable. And this one also. Now, if you press the tab button, you get a little bit more extra info on everything here. Um, so what we can see is, I don't really know what we can see there. Uh, it has space for a backyard extension maybe, is that what it's telling me? I think backyard extensions are good, but we don't have any regional wealth. Now I'm wondering if I build a backyard extension, is that when they start... Um, well, I guess we'll find out. Is this how they start gaining some wealth? We'll find out soon. Stables under construction. Let's just fast forward a little bit. Small stables are complete. So, it's just annoying that I can't see. I wish I could see if the livestock were assigned there. Do you know what I mean? Like, do they live here? Obviously, they're, they're getting... I don't know. Maybe here. How are hunters doing? We've got some meat and we've got hides. Um, I don't know where the meat gets stored otherwise. That little farger hut is all good there. Granary, we still got some berries left. Uh, we got enough for 12 months, so even if the fuel is doubled in the winter, we're still we're still good. Um, okay, there's nothing stored in the stonecutter camp. 
That's okay, we don't need that at the moment. Don't have enough wealth. Oh, there's another bug. Not underscore enough underscore wealth. That feels like a bug as well. Uh, cause I, I definitely do have enough space. And this is telling me that storage is full, but I've got a full another storehouse. Get stored. The answer is I do not know at all. One guy out hunting, these other plying by hand. Oh, he's building his. Okay. Who's out hunting then? Lorenz. Shall we watch Lorenz for a second, see what he gets up to? Not a lot. Uh, let's just fast forward a little bit. Can't zoom in any further when he's when he's going this quick. Super wow. Well, he's done a whole lot of nothing, really. To be fair. Okay, so we've still got enough to do us for 12 months, but food may be an issue. Still got people on the firewood. Let's see, is there somewhere where I can store... It must just be a standard storehouse that can hold meat. fair. Uh, maybe the granary? I feel like does that just store all food? Ah yeah it does. There we go. Answer my own question. Well Approval's good. We've got a firewood stall in the market. Still zero regional wealth. November. 
It is gonna. It definitely is gonna be winter soon. family come on I yes I need to figure that out <laughs> I need, need to work out what's going on there um but a new family yes come on come on we're into it okay back, back, back. I probably just got the quality set too high, to be fair. Well, look, we're on the map. Okay, now we're in December. It has started to snow. It started to snow. It's nothing to worry about, though. Sheesh. Sheesh. I agree, mate. There's snow on the ground. Um, I'm just hoping we're in a good enough position for the winter here. Oh, we've got loads of firewood surplus. The only thing we don't have a lot off right now is food and so that is a little bit worrying these guys are growing their own food um, I'm wondering food left and you gotta remember that each family that moves in uses more food so we've got to keep an eye on that I think but I reckon I honestly reckon just build another hunting thing Trading post is something I feel like we should have. Just uh, just straight as you come into town. We'll get our unassigned family on the map. Will you run out of food if you have fat little kid villagers? Yeah, I mean, if I if I do have some wee Humpty Dumpties running around, could could run out of food faster. It's always the kids that are fat, isn't it? Fat little kids. Fuck them. Don't actually fuck the kids. <laughs> That's not. Anyway, moving on. Dream band.
Um, I don't really know what to do at this point. Well, I just kind of need to wait in this trading post to be built. Approval written, still going up. Public order's good. Approval written's down. Ooh, that arrow was pointing down. Oh, it's up? Okay, maybe that's bugged a little bit. We don't have any meat. Have you seen any combat? Not yet. No combat yet. I think... I think I set it so there's no combat for three years. So that gives me enough time to kind of get sorted. So we'll sign a family here. It's small. Yeah, boy. No, I don't need to put livestock there. Whoa, okay. Never trade stone. Desired surplus of stone. Um, well, how many do we have? 29. Let's make sure we always have 10 stone. Planks. Yeah, we can export planks. How many do we have? 21. Kind of... 21? Let's say... Let's always have 10. Oh, that's... That's a 1. I don't have any crops to sell. Don't have any food to sell. I need to hold on to my food for now. But what we can sell is stone and planks. So... That is something, at least. Uh, well, we're not dead yet. We got nine months left of food. Can you give me a summary of what you've been at? What's the next goal? Ah, he hasn't been watching. So, here's my town. We've got uh, six, seven, eight, nine homes. We've got eight families living. Um, any family assigned to a job will do their job. Any family unassigned will... Uh, be working on construction, but I'm not building anything at the moment, so I don't need a family on construction. Got a trading post here. It's good to do a little recap anyway. We've got a trading post here, so hopefully this can bring us in some regional wealth. Now, we need regional wealth to buy certain things. Um, I can't remember what I need regional wealth for, but I need it for something. Uh, so, that's what I'm doing. C creating some regional wealth. Uh, oh, yeah, that's right. So, uh, to do these extensions, I need wealth. Um, and this is this means people can grow their own food. So, there will always be some extra food to be sold. So, we've got that. Uh, and we got these three houses. And we've got one empty house, which means another family should hopefully move in soon. Now, because it's winter, we don't have any berries available for hunting but we still do have 61 berries left and two meat because i've got two families as uh hunting at the moment so my approval has gone down that is not ideal see that's that's pretty much it at the moment the the current goal is to survive survive the winter once we survive the winter, hey i got some regional wealth nice I don't know. I don't know where that has come from, but sure, we'll take it. It's ten regional wealth. Another five regional wealth means I can build another extension to one of these burgage plots. Um, I assume I must have sold something for trade. I don't really know, but I do have a family working here. So, let's see how our hunters are getting on. Uh, so we got one, he's just going hunting. 
She's just, she's just fucking. Nah, I can't be arsed. I'm just gonna fucking walk. Where are you, where are you going? Transporting. Alright, fair enough. She is actually working. I take it back. <laughs> she's doing some transporting. Hey, uh, he's, he's done some hunting. Don't know what she's fucking about with a, an ox for. Um. Hey, we got we got some new family members. Let's fucking go. Man, it takes so long by the time I get here. <laughs> this is great. Uh, I'm glad you like it, man. Uh, it takes so long for me to get from. You know what I mean? Focusing on all the wee people. Let's try and get a little bit. Oh no, I'm I've frozen it. Let's just turn everything down to high. We don't need volumetric clouds. Come on. Um. To be fair, I didn't know how this was going to run on my computer, so we turn everything to high. Maybe, maybe then, maybe. Arnade should sample your transition crashing. <laughs> he should. <laughs> he should. I don't know what's going on with it. Uh, I think. Ele Mao. I think I fixed it. Let's try one more time. Great success! Whoa, computer boy. Alright, back to the game. Uh, granary. Your granny's in the granary. Get your granny out of the granary. We got no meat. We're definitely running low on supplies here. Generic storage full where? What? Maybe, maybe it's this. Maybe it's the saw pit. How are we doing for logs? Ah, oh, loads. It's just the food. Just the food that's the issue. Um. good if we could import some food but we don't need to do that just yet I mean we're still surviving let's see I mean there are people hunting where's soldier not yet I do have All these headphones. Uh, I do have the tools for a militia. I've got 20 spears and 20 large shields. Yeah, this is definitely bugged out, hasn't it? Not enough stable space. I, I literally have two stables. Regional wealth goes up slowly. I 
thought he said so fucking juicy there. I think he said so plump and juicy. Bears out away hunting. So they're still over here to these wild animals. He's he's done he's done good. Good boy. Dits also. Barbara. Guiding an ox. Of course. Of course she's just on her fucking merry journey. On her way to fucking Mordor, like with the ox. What are, what are you doing with that ox? Just fucking the ox. Fuck sake, she's fucking the ox, guys. You eat ox shagger. The ox does look pretty strong, though, doesn't it? Um, I can't build any more burgage plots because it's too cold and I don't have any food. The more families move in, the more food it takes to look after them. So I, what I'm saying is we just continue to build around the market with houses. I think, I think that's the best option. So I'm going to put a... I'm gonna put like a wee logging camp or something out here. Start clearing some trees. Um, to make way for that. Which fucking... Lo right, a logging camp. Or do I just want a woodcutter's lodge? Let's just do a wee woodcutter's lodge here. What does the arrow mean, like? Is that just the direction that it's facing? Music beat loud. Music's a bit loud. Not better. Please say yes. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. No problem. The music's actually quite good. Maybe I have to spawn on a road though. That's probably pretty much done. All right. Well, let's uh, get these guys over here as well. Still got a family in the logging camp, that's good. One in the saw pit, we do need that. Uh, still got our burgage plots ticking along. Tickety boo. I need a drink. My water's empty. Um, Alright, let's make it through the winter and then I'm going to take a break, go get a drink, go to the toilet and then I'll be back in like five minutes. But uh, let's, um, let's make it out of the winter.
can buy another ox as well. That's uh, good to know. I don't even need this storehouse now. I think if I... I think if I demolish it though, I'll... That'll be... The firewood will be... Just chilling there. That's fine. I don't know. Ah, oh, someone's just come to move it straight away. Love it. Lovely jubbly. Right, we got exposed goods. That's okay. They are currently in the process of being moved. Oh. Oh. So, we've got water. Everyone wants a church. I don't know what the exclamation point means. Stonecutter can we got no one working there at the moment, but that's okay, because we are clearing some trees. To be fair, this is this is this is way too slow for my liking. Let's get a logging pump in here as well. Get one of these guys to construct it. It is February though. The snow is starting to thaw. Love to see it. The snow is thawing. Snow is thawing all around me. Beep bop boop bop 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 bop. Just checking my levels. Just checking my levels. Don't don't even stress about it. Don't even worry. Your mouth is moving a lot like a rat. Yappa 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 yappa. Shut it, please. So that's where our stone deposits are. Clay out here. What else we got? That's where our animals. Still got 16 left. So once that gets down to 10, they will stop hunting. So I feel like our trading post is actually bringing us in some money. That's good. Um, seven months of food left. But it's almost spring. Right. Let's get one family in that logging camp then. Clear some trees. And then I think the next thing to do is... Oh shit. An army. Where? No, what? What's this? Berries. Outlaws. Outlaws. Mm. I'm not seeing an army anywhere. I will just check. I mean, if there was an army here, surely I'd see them. this mean this is aha right there is an army down here okay well now now things got serious there's an army oh 
Where the where are these bandits, by the way? By the nearby bandits, is it these guys up here? Has to be. There's no one else. All right, where's my time? Berries are seasonal. They must be starting to grow soon. Hey, we we did it! Hey, let's go! We fucking. Ladies and gentlemen, we have made it through the first year. We did it. Um, that's uh. Sweet. My RAM definitely seem. My PC is definitely struggling here a little bit. Which is good stuff. Good day stuff. Uh, the PC is definitely struggling here a little bit by the looks of it. Bap bap bap. Bap 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 bap. I tell you what is probably doing the damage here. That little background. Yeah, my CPU has dropped rapidly. So do you know what we'll just do? Take this. And uh, that's not what I wanted to do. Hold on. We're doing this on the fly now. Uh, fit the screen. Hey, there we go. That's better. And uh, let's just bring this up here. Scooby Doo up. Okay, so we are a year into into our time in Manor Lord, um, and I'm still alive, which is a shock to me as much as it is to you, I'm sure. Uh, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to pause for a little break and go, well, I say a break, I'm going to go for five minutes so I can go pee and uh, get a drink. I've just been, uh, I just realized I've been talking away and um, my mic was muted. <laughs> Alright, well let's recap everything that I just said then. Um, where do we start? Well, I went and got a drink. That I did. Um, and then I sat down and I said, oh... I've gone for a Rockshore Lager, uh, Rockshore Cider, sorry, today, um, mainly because that is what I had in my fridge, and it's Friday night, and we're having a little cerveza, um, so that's that's pretty much what I said, and then I said, oh, we're, we're, we'll get back into the game now, um, is there anyone still in the chat, and then I said, oh, what does Baba Booey sound like, <laughs> sound like by the voice chat and uh, that's when I typed in ba -ba -boo. Bea, bea, boo -boo. and that's when we got that and that's pretty much where we are and I just noticed that the volume is really high there for the music so if you could hear me over the music then congrats um, anyway and it was that point I was like okay let's get back into the game so uh, welcome back I'm sorry I took so long if, if you feel like I took so long um non-intentional uh so let's let's just without any further ado and without me chatting any more shite let us get back into manor lords year two uh, let's do it <clears throat> all right we're back in it manor lords year two Where's my time? Okay. So. 
Berries are going to be grown again soon. Seasonal, but uh, they should be coming back. So this is the point now where I can start. Um, I can probably start building some more burgage plots, and uh, we can start looking for more berries as well. So I can build a herb garden here. Um, nothing stored in there. What have we got in the granary? Just, just some berries. Okay. So they're doing a good job of clearing here. I wish they would just come this way a little bit. Um, because this is where we're going to be building more houses. We're going to be building some more burgage plots along here. Um, facing this way. Because we'll just surround the market. With some burgage plots. Uh, I, just, I'm, I am just now realising though this logging camp. All these logs are going to be here, uh, so I'm going to need to move that sooner rather than later. But once they get some of this cleared, we'll need that wood to uh, build stuff anyway, so we should be okay. Um, well, 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 we'll get it moved at some point. Ah, oh, that is going down a treat. So, I'm wondering, do we start <clears throat> growing some stuff here? BRB. Okay. See you when you're back. Yeah, I'll speak to you when you're back. Something. I don't know. Let's get some chickens in. So we have a supply of eggs. Now I'm assuming that family comes and builds that themselves. So we're into March. How are our berries doing? They're starting to grow. That's good. Clack, clack. Clack, clack. It's finger looking good. Um... So yeah, I think we can build around here. We'll come up this way around. I can't demolish the marketplace, but I kind of need to move it. But if I move it, do I lose everything that's in it? That's what I don't know. I wonder if there's any way to stop that as well. Like, stop the mice from moving the screen. Um, so, we'll now have a passive supply of eggs. That's good. Uh, and I can also... I could also build... Could also build some vegetables here as well. Because I have enough money. At some point, once these berries start growing, we will get, um, get, take the hunters. But for now, we don't need to do that because we still need them out hunting. Because uh, we still need a food supply at the moment. So, I, this is kind of like, it should be taking care of itself at this point. Almost, you know? Um... Because the market's here, I think probably build a few more burgage plots down here. Uh, if I could move this granary, I would, but I I don't know. I'm just worried if I demolish this granary, 
I'm hoping I don't lose. Um, Bonavo play Xbox will take back when I'm blonking. Okay, brother. Uh, please join us a little bit later. I'm still gonna be about probably until I don't know. I'll probably be here until like fucking one a.m. Uh, so come join us in a bit. Or feel free to fucking keep me on your phone. Just listen, listen to my dulcet tones. Well, thanks for tuning in, mate. Appreciate it. Anyway. So. What I want is probably a burgage plot here. Or at least a house. Here. Here, here. And then we'll go round. So, two... At least one full size one here, and then we'll go up here and then down this way as well. You know what I'm saying? And then around, and that kind of gives us our main homes. Um, I don't know what the requirements are to upgrade Oh, I need I need a church and a clothing supply stall. But I don't have any linen, leather or yarn. How do I make so I, I have hides somewhere. Possibly in my storehouse. Yeah, I've got hides, so I need to make those into leather. Produces meat and hides, right? No. Logistics. Mm, industry. Iron. Converts clay to clay tiles. No, no, no. Hides the leather. That's what we want. We need one of these. So, in the little industrial part of town, that's just the main road in. You gotta pass our trading post to get into the town. Then you also gotta pass other bits and pieces. Um, you get down to this logging camp that is, uh, well, it's still going. But it's full. So, we don't actually need that there. Um, I think I just need to move this over. Move this logging camp over here so it starts taking away these trees as well. Uh, what am I doing? Gathering timber. gather these timbers. So we got two families now. Berries are growing. Let's get the hunters onto the berries then. And uh, we'll get a load of berries resources gathered. Um, I do need to move the granary though. And I'm just going to move it down by the forager's hut. Uh, right. Granary. Just here. So hopefully they will transport all this stuff from the granary down as well. Um, Cause there was a stall for the granary there. So the tannery construction is finished. 
So let's get one family in here working. Construction finished on the new logging camp. Um, so we'll get a family back in there. E. I. 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 Chenow is being claimed. Hofstetten. Hofstetten. Zvayu. Okay, it's over here. That's. That's really okay. Because I'm over here. And I mean, I do have the biggest state here. Or, or region. I do have the biggest region here, so. I'm not, uh, not too worried there. But now I kind of now I kind of know what I'm doing. I don't know where the berries went that were in there. Farmy, farmy, uh, family assigned to the granary, um, and the stonecutter camp can be moved as well. So we've got two families in the forager hut. Um, let's see, we still need that clothing stall. But we're almost there because we've now got a family. Ah, there we go. Okay, so we're one step closer. Marketplace, food stall, clothing stall. Um. So there's a no, there's only one family. Those stocks are getting soaked. I mean, I can't really do anything about that. This is heavier than it looks. Is she gonna move that? Well, I can build. I kind of want this whole area cleared before I start building burgage plots, but I'm thinking I can build one here. Build one big one here. Let's get, that get us another family in. Um, I know that I'm going to have two. Well, I'm going to have a row of burgage plots here against the uh, market. I need um. Now what? I'm a bit... I made a bit of an error here with this. Uh... The marketplace. But I think... Uh, I 
should be able to move the marketplace again, but I, I do need it. I need another sound family here. Um, these woodcutters can build a house. So what I what I'm actually gonna do is I'm gonna build this and demolish this to make it easier to get around to this other side so I can actually start building houses on the other side there. So what I need to do is I need to demolish this. Before another fam pretty much before another family moved in here. So hopefully now this family, yeah, automatically being assigned there. Uh, so in that case, I don't actually need to move the marketplace. So we're good. Okay. Um, so this road. Uh, some curvature. Construct that road. I really need someone to move those supplies because they're just sat there. Um, so I don't want to build another burgage plot here because I know that I'm planning to build some here, but I just need to get these supplies moved first. So I think my best bet is probably just to build one here for now, or build a few, build a couple. And I'm pretty sure a logging camp is the only place for log storage, which is a bit annoying, but... Oh well, it is what it is. So, let's just build... Well, let's see, we can probably build two here for now. this way. So these need to be really... You'll not find fireways anywhere else. That's not what I want. <laughs> Flip sake. Right, well... All I can do is build one here then, until I get that space cleared. But I'll... Build one with plenty of extension space. Uh, do you know what? I'm just going to build a big one here. Or do I want to leave this space here free? Um, well, no, I don't really need to. Root access obstructed. If I put it like here. Well, with any luck. I'll use these supplies. Get them out of the way. I've now got the issue of more supplies here. I didn't think about that. So I need to get those. I need to. They need to stop collecting. Because. Kind of. They've done enough now.
At least they moved those. That's good. That's good. Um, I can join. Join this route up. Generic storage full. Where? Another well, ruler's army was sighted. See, I'm really not loving the sound of that. <laughs> Just as long as they're not on my land, but they are fucking. They are close, like. I've made quite the clearing over here. Um, so now this logging comes in the way. And this also. So they can come back to this one. This logging camp. All right, we got a new family in. And we can also double the living space for it as well. So, okay. Well, I feel like, I feel like, I definitely feel like I'm getting somewhere. If you are in the chat, do give us some love. Give us some love. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. Keep your lot to handle the month old brat. You spat it in my face, tried to carve me a new nipple. Tried to carve me a new nipple. Surround him. <laughs> If anything's making me think I need to upgrade my CPU, it is definitely this game. I hope the stream is going smoothly enough, though. That, uh, just remember that little song ID thing I have there. That one doesn't work. The other one does, though. Um, so I, I, I spent some time the last couple of days just... Uh, I don't even know if the alert box works. It should. But I, it's been so long since I used it, I don't know if it still works. I hope so. I hope my alerts do work because the lights will flash and stuff if, if I get like a, if I get a new follower or I get a new subscriber or someone donates bits. Um, it should all flash and shit. Which is fun. Anyway. Let's get... 
Let's get some more burgage plots built. And then we need to... So I think I'll have another house here, but only small. So I think if we start one from, like, here. And then we build quite a few here, I reckon. I don't see why not. So you just build it the whole way out here. And then hopefully... Can I take this up further? Will it just kind of wrap? Yeah. So that gives me space for five new houses with extensions. And then here, we build the whole way along. I'm back, Iska. Hello. Welcome back, Iska. Um, if I go from here then up to here, and then that can go there. And see, this keeps trying, <laughs> this keeps trying to fucking block the road. So, well, I need to, I just need to build the road first then. That like curvy, just just so it looks cool. I don't know. Build that. To there. Boom. To there. Boom. To there. Boom. To there. To there. Boom. There. To there. Boom. Okay, which hopefully means then now when I try to build this, it won't. Obstruct the road. Nice. Ah, and there's space for three. Okay, so. I need to steal a family from somewhere. <laughs> I need to steal a family. <laughs> what did he miss? Uh, you didn't miss too much, man. I just have now. So. I started building over here to clear these trees. Um, I, I put down a forestry. Uh, forestry camp here and the woodcutter camp here just to clear away some of these trees um, so I can build burgage plots around here like a square I built another one here uh, we started we stopped uh, we stopped collecting meat and we started collecting berries again because we're into May now um, so I've got a burgage plot here that's a new one and I built a new one over here, so we've got a couple of new families. Uh, I've also opened up a tannery, which converts my hides that I got from Humden. Um, and it converts those into uh, leather. So we've got that. And then we got chickens here. And yeah, now we're just waiting on the building to be done. Um, and I'm just trying to see who I can unassign for a sec to help with the building. So that's pretty much it. Yeah, just built one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I've built ten new burgage plots, and oh, no, I only two of them are done. But we'll just fast forward until they're done. Um, but welcome back. Thanks for joining me again. I really like this game, you know? This is, this is very Good enjoyable. Stuff. Very, very enjoyable, this game, look. Like. Do you think you'll get it? There we go. Construction finished. All these ones have extensions on the he back as well. He might have to. Yeah, uh... I am glad to hear that because I think you'll like it and uh, it's free on Game Pass but if you have the money I would buy it just to support the developer because I mean look at the job he's done it's awesome and I normally wouldn't say that I really I really normally would not say that but I think this game 
this game is just the... It's just one of those rare occurrences where, yeah, do buy it. Don't, don't, don't do, don't try and get this game for free. Um, unless someone buys it for you, of course. Don't try and get it for free. Support the developer, because fucking hell, like, he's done this himself. This is crazy. It's crazy. The one, ma like, I have, de I know I've developed a game before. Uh, with, uh, that was, for me, it was with no experience. I'm sure he has experience, but. It's hard. It really is hard. And to do it all one person, like, has he done all the modeling and stuff as well? Like, these might not, these are probably, these are probably, like, custom models of all these houses and the fences and, like, you know, each little thing. He had to, he had to build, he had to construct, like, a fence. Um, Crazy. Model, do you know what I mean? He had to, he had to model these fences. And these characters and and the clues. Yeah, my town's kind of bustling now, isn't it? Crazy how much it's grown already. This person looks smooth too. Yeah, and he puts a little disclaimer here as well, saying very early in development, expect glitches. But um. No, it's working pretty well, like. It's quite cool. I wonder if I need to build another well. I think, I don't know if there's like plans for third person mode to become something even further. But, uh. Hey, you! I'm interested. I'm, I'm fully, I'm fully, in, I'm fully involved in this, like. I'm fully into it. The, the development, everything. I'm is just, there I'm combat? Just into it. Yeah, there is. There's like Total War style um, battles. So, at any point, someone could come and challenge me here. And they will after the third year. But, uh, if you look, there's some bandits here. And I'm pretty sure if I was to come across them, I could or would have to fight them. Um, but before, I think while you were gone, there was an army that came through here. Uh, they passed through. And someone, the army, they they took this bit of land. They claimed it. And it's cool that um, it like... Or from above, it turns into a, an actual a map. Very cool. Looks like a hand-drawn map. It's pretty. It's pretty. Pretty cool. Uh, so. A sleek. A sleek. Um, some more eggs possibly, and hides as well. Not a bad shout. Uh, I do need to build a stonemason's hut as well pretty soon. So let's go for the chickens for that one. We'll do veg here. And veg here. And this one. We'll go for goats from the hides. So that has fucking spanked our cash a little bit, but it's, it's good. It's fine. It's worth it. Um. So what else can we trade here? Can I trade? I can trade some hides. Okay, so let's export hides. Uh, let's make sure we keep like five. Um, what else have I got that I can export? None of that. Food. Eggs. Yeah, I can export eggs because I've got a supply always of eggs happening. So I've only got one. So let's just keep the surplus at like four eggs. Um, we can export veg, but we want to keep that at like four. Uh, and we can export berries. But we want to always have like a hundred minimum. So that'll, that's some stuff that we can just sell. Um, we can also sell planks and stone. Uh, I do need to maybe think about collecting some more stone, because I've only got 10 left. I 
I do have three families not doing anything right now. Let's get one more collecting firewood. We want to be doing that all year round. I've got loads of logs still. Um, I can probably fit in another burgage plot here, so let's get another one built. I'll extend this land right up here. Actually. Get another one there. Uh, storehouse is good. Ah, oh, these are still being built. Okay. In the June now, it's summer. So that's another year without farming, but I feel like farming is like a... I don't know, like a, a, f a few years down the line. Also, I've just realized that you can't see these here overlays whenever I'm talking about them. So I'm just going to move my camera slightly, I think. So that it's just not covering anything. Will it fit just above June there? Yeah, yeah, just about. There we go. That's better. And that way, my camera's not covering anything. Nice. Back to the game. <laughs> um, okay, so. We got all these burgage plots. We got an excess of burgage plots now. Some more eggs. I think... I think having a passive yield of eggs is pretty is pretty good. Um, okay, so that those logs have all been used up, so I can build another couple of burgage plots here. Let's see how many it gives us. I'll go right up to the road here. This. Three. Three more. Nice. Okay. And then we can just add some root to these as well. So two unassigned families. They're going to get built in there. Um, and once that's done, then we'll get all the families on berry picking duty. Hey, new family. Alright, well, now that they've moved in, let's get them foraging as well. So, the population is 36. Nice. I'm happy with that so far. Hey, the lights are looking nice, aren't they? I was, um, I think I was playing around with them while they were gone, possibly, but, uh, they look, they're looking, they're looking good at night. Got the blue. Got red and like a blue gradient vibe going on here. That's supposed to be anyway. I can turn them off. Um, hey. Anyway, it's cool being able to just control them from here. Okay, so we got ten families here. Uh, Rabe. Rabe. I was gonna say my my other light's not on, but it is. I got a blue light under me. You can see the blue over this shoulder, reflecting off the TV. left. Okay. So 
So I got four extra families. Uh. See, this is good because I want this all to be deforested here because you wouldn't have been able to see this earlier because you couldn't see the um, overlay. But this is all really good farming land for rye. So I can grow some rye there. Um, and also emmer. So, uh... That's that's one for the for the future, but I think we're getting close to the future now. You no, know? I think we're nearly at that point. Um, go veg on this one. We go eggs. I think fucking rinse the eggs. Not enough wealth. Ah, I used all my money. Well, since there's nothing in the forager hut, and I've got four families doing nothing, let's get two families back out hunting again. And then... So plump and juicy, you'll want to eat them by the bushel. I think we need to build a little... Uh, stone... Mining place out here. Can I build a road out to that, maybe? Oh, well, there's a road there. I can't, I can't build that. Oh, yeah, I can. Great. What's that? That is a, um, stone cutter camp. So they will mine stone for me because my stone levels are pretty low. Um, and I'm also kind of low on timber, so I think get someone back in logging. Um, you need stone to just build. Uh, some so Certain like buildings need stone. So like the granaries need stone. And there's a few others, I'm not too sure. Currently got enough to last 23 months. So we're looking good for winter, I think. And I'm also trading. I'm selling stuff here. Berries, eggs, vegetables. Uh, I don't have enough of a surplus of all that. So, still selling planks. Um... And what are the planks made from? They're made from the logs. Okay. So we do have one in the saw pit. And then we have one, hopefully, heading out this way to build. Yeah. I need these guys to help build. New family in. Excellent. Well, then I'll get this built in no time. And then we'll get families assigned to that as well. Uh, I think maybe just over here. I think we just build, build a little hunter camp. right on the road as well and uh, let's put a hitching post out here as well and then we can buy another ox um. is it possible to build like a small castle that your villagers can retreat to if you get attacked uh, there's a manor 
I did see a YouTube video of someone building a wall around their city, so it can be done. I just don't know exactly how to just yet. Um, but I'm sure I will get there. But yeah, uh, the the manor I think is is that kind of um, that kind of castle almost. But you need a higher settlement level. You need small village as well. But I think it's almost time for me to build a church, which I'm going to build here at the head of my square. You see? Put the church in the middle of my square. I don't even know where the church is. Sis. What do is a church do? Um, so you need a church to level up. See, so you can see these requirements to level these houses up to the next level. And they've got everything they need apart from a church. So, that's what we've got to do. We've got to, um, build a church. Which I think I have... Ah, uh, I don't have enough planks. Okay. Well, once I have enough planks, I will build a church then. Um... Is this built? Oh, flip me. It is ages away, to be fair. What I need to do is build some hitching posts. As well. Where are they? Uh, logistics. Hitching post. here as well. Stonecutter camp is finished. So, let's get a family in here at least. Probably need two. And then the last one can just keep building. Sign those two to the hunting camp, and I think we need another ox. Coming into autumn now, here very soon. So I've got 13 families, but how many homes do I have? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Oh wait, is there just a way to see? I got 23. But only 13 families, so I'm hoping... I'm hoping we get some families in here soon, like... Uh, I do need another family for... <laughs> I need some more people to be woodcutters for me. Bandit camp sighted. How did you get more? How did I get more what? How did I get more people to live here? Um... People. Uh, I, I don't think I can specifically. I just need to build my town big enough to make people want to come. I think is is kind of is kind of what I'm gauging. Well, I've got enough resources to build a church now. No, no, no. no. All right, let me build. Let me build this road. Church should help. 
Yeah, I'm, that's what I'm thinking. Alright. We're gonna reroad here. Ah, do you know what? That road is... People suffering from disease may stop working. Access to herbs might speed up their recovery. Oh shit. Okay. Um, that was just me opening a herb garden to save the people who are sick. So, let me remove this road. I went on a little bit too far. Well, no, actually, these trees have just grown back, haven't they? You know, that's okay. No, I, I kind of wanted that road to curve a little bit. up a little bit. There we go. And then build a church here. Lovely. There we go. Yeah. So I think a church is probably going to help me get more people. It's definitely going to make people happier as well. We've only got one family building at the moment though. Oh, here we go. We've got an army sided. I can show you the armies. Over here. Yeah, they're nowhere near me though, so I'd only be concerned if I started seeing one like over here or over here. But at the moment, we're still all good. Look how big my town looks on the map as well. Um... Transporting. Okay. What are you livestock there? Alright, church under construction now. This is a milestone. I think I'll get an I think I'll get a reward for I think I'll get um, a trophy for building this church. And then once the church is built, we'll get everyone on log duty. For firewood. Um Although we're actually pretty good for firewood. I'll maybe get everyone on hunting duty then. What is he doing around here? There's no one there. People. Just realize this there no gold. No gold, no. I don't know if that's something that's possibly coming in the future or not, but uh, not at the moment, no gold. But there's this, is your regional wealth, and then you've got a treasury here. So you can use your treasury then to pay for soldiers. So when you, you can hire mercenaries. 
um, and that comes from your treasury budget. So once you can create taxes, it's kind of, I, I guess it is kind of like gold, but it's used for different things, you know. Everything's all about resources. Your, your main, your main currency is your resources in this. Um, Our game makes sense. Yeah. Charge is, charge is nearly done. There she is in all her glory. Nearly there. Can you put the TTS back to the leash guy PLS? Okay. <laughs> yeah. L U L. There you go. Is this one? What's this one like? Hello. Hello. There we go. <laughs> Sorry about that, bro. Um, right, church is nearly done. We're in October now. Uh, church is done. Let's go. Fucking hell, the church is done. A new milestone has been hit. The church is finished. Okay. Hey, we got new family members. Pog champ, pog champ. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. Got an achievement there for changing the church bell sign. Hey you, no slacking off. Hey you, no slacking off. What are you gonna do, big nuts? Right, we need more food. Not got enough berries. Has my new oxen arrived yet? My new ox arrived yet? One. Ah, yeah, it has. Okay. That's good. Who do I have a sign out here? I got two people to sign out here as well. Ah, shit. Ah, have I hunted too many fucking animals here? Where... Where are these guys going hunting? Ah, shit. These are down to nine. He, he needs to stop hunting there. What? Why is he still? Why is he still going? Do you know what I mean? What? What is going on here? I. Uh Hmm. This guy's coming back. Then I, I've got this other hunting camp here. Okay. Well, this, this has just made things um, interesting. Upgrade 
with these. I actually don't know what I'm going to do about food, to be honest. And I hope no more people join How many families winter. now? Uh... 13. 15, sorry. Pretty good for fuel. I need, I think I need to. I can't do some farming. It's fucking October. Oh dear. Should be doing any hunting either. Panic. Yeah, a little bit. You know what? Just taking those people off the hunting camp. Put someone in the. Someone. Well, we do have quite a lot of berries. We got 206 berries. I need to stop them being sold. If I stop the berries being sold, I think they might be okay. Man, have I got 206? Yeah. Alright, let's not sell any more berries. But I still have people collecting stone for me. Bring this here, move that there, on and on. Um, how much stone have we got? 147, right. Well, I don't need... I don't need them gathering stone anymore for now. So I'm thinking I'm going to set up a camp over here. If I can. Hopefully it doesn't start a fucking war. We'll see. Right. Farm workers plow the fields as soon as winter passes, but no later than November. Then they sow them with chosen crop. Harvest happens around September. So if I want to prepare for next winter... Let's fucking pause this before we go too far. If I want to prepare for next winter now... What, there's, what it's saying is I need to maybe build a farmhouse. Um, because it's October. So... This is good farming space here. All of this, where the trees are already gone, this is great farming space. So I'm thinking... If we build a farmhouse just here... Build a farmhouse just... Just here. And then we can use these fields all out. We can build the fields all out the back. Alright, here we go. This is the first time we're doing a field. <laughs> Woohoo, fields! <laughs> 
Show me some fields. There's a lot of people streaming Mana Lords now at the moment. Just just having a look there, see how many many of us are there. Well, not in, we're not in short supply. Uh, okay, fields and Manor Lord need to be very large to be effective, but also take long to plow by hand. For starting village, try a field size of about one Morgan. What the fuck does that mean? Later, if you want the region to focus on farming, you can consider spending a development point to unlock heavy ply upgrade, which allows plowing much bigger fields far more effectively use utilizing oxen. Also, remember to check the ground fertility. Some crop types are more picky on the soil. So we can have emmer here. And rye is pretty good. Rye is the best. So, let's go from here. And how big do we want this field? Yeah, let's do that. Farmhouse employs families who work on their fields. The workforce is distributed proportionally in accordance with the field's set priority level. When crops are growing, they absorb certain nutrients from the soil, temporarily lowering, lowering its fertility and thus diminishing yields over time. To combat this, consider changing crop types, or even better, leaving the field to follow for a year. Yeah, okay, so we gotta rotate. We gotta rotate the crops. Complex. Yeah, man, this is uh, pretty in-depth. So we gotta rotate the crops. I'm thinking I'll build two fields here, two large fields. And then um, what else have we got here? Is there anything else fertile? Emmer. Uh, okay, we can definitely do some emmer out here. If we go this far, although I shouldn't really be cutting down these trees. Let's um, just put another field here, but let's not get rid of any trees. Okay, so now we got three fields. This one. Okay, I can't grow what rye. Is that wheat? That is wheat, right? Uh, well, wheat's wheat's the best there. I can't I can't grow flax, so it has it has to be wheat. But there is a little bit of barley fertility down here as well. But I think I think two of these big fields just grow wheat on them. Second year follow, third year wheat. This year follow, second year wheat. And then we'll decide what to do with this one at the time. Third year follow. Yeah, okay. That works. Um, okay. So we've got... Six families not doing anything. They can construct the farmhouse. Uh, 
Uh, you gotta use a f you can use the fallow field as a pasture, but you need the development branch for it. So how do I even get into my development branches here? I think I should spend a development point on farming. Yeah. I think so. Um, this one. So I can plow the fields faster. I think that's the one. Yeah. How can I build a pasture though? That would be cool if I could just build one like over here. Just this little piece of land. And then that means I can get some cows or something. I don't know. Sheep. Because this is quite hilly, I don't think you could really use it for farming. How do I, how do I trade livestock? There's, um, I need, uh, livestock trading post in one of these. I hope I managed to get some of these fields plowed before winter. Okay, farmhouse is almost finished. Yes. Okay, farmhouse is finished. Let's add a plowing station. Get these fucking fields plowed. Let me plow your field. Oh, new family in as well. Hey! Let's go! Let's bring it go! A new settlement level has Double been game. unlocked. Let's go! Alright, that brings us up a level. We got another skill point available. Um. We got some policies as well here. I don't know. I don't know how these work. Nothing in production there. Okay, so another skill point. 
Um, foreign suppliers, a permanent market stall which provides a passive income of firewood. I don't know. I think I need to hold off before I buy anything else until I figure out what I need to do. Can't see. Oh shit, sorry. <laughs> Laughing face. Uh, um, well, the wild animals are recovering, so they should be good by uh at the end of winter. Alright, let's see if I manage to get any of these fields plowed. Apply it and sow the crop as soon as possible. Yield will increase. Alright. Get plowing. there now as well. I don't know what that means. There's another little bug there. I should probably make a note of these, but um... Oh well. Right. Have we got the ox in here helping yet? What the heck is that ox doing like? Where are they taking that wood? Ah, oh, there's still shit being built. Why is everyone going to that field instead of finishing this one? Don't understand why. Ah, oh, there is a there is an ox there finally. We are definitely low on food and fuel. Settlement level increased. Let's go. Well, it's December now, so no more fields getting ploughed. 
Um, everyone's going home. Alright, well, I'll we'll keep two there. Get another two onto that. Uh, that still leaves me with four people, four families. Can they go hunting again yet? Thirteen. Yeah. So we'll send we'll send two families out hunting. Um. Send one family here. We want to import in some sheep. We like two. New family. Great. Um. see a tree there. It's a, it's a weird looking tree. Lol. Alright, we got more people and not enough food. This, it, I've fucked, I've fucked up here like. Right, uh, we've still got 23 houses, we've now got 18 families. Is the issue that I'm selling all my eggs? Hold on, let's just fucking stop selling eggs. The veg. We gotta stop selling food. Might not be a bad idea to get a horse. Ah. Oh. Well, that would maybe fit in there. Can put a hitching post there, though. Do I buy a horse? Don't know. I don't really know what I would what I use it for. Let's go back to a stable straight away.
you add another new family in. Uh oh. <laughs> I don't really know what a horse does, but I'm going to get one. Can't imagine there'd be any negatives to having a horse. This is all good farmland out here as well, so it's good that it's still clearing these trees. Uh, Just one. I can only buy, you can only buy one per month. Um, orders can be placed once a month. So, I can't buy another, I can't get another trader for 23 days. Rip. Yup. Family's just doing nothing, so we had some more out logging. Not constructing anything at the moment, so um, sign a family to the stable. Why do I have to carry this alone? Stop crying. Shut up. Uh, hopefully we can make it through the winter. We're into January now, so... It's positive. Let's not be cutting down those trees now. We need we need these berries. I'm gonna plant some more trees here, uh, which means I need a forester's hut. Workers plant new trees in the specified zone. Two families about to do that. Well, on the bright side, we're still alive. Um, the Forester's Hut's done. Straight away, let's get a family in there. Steaming through. Yeah, I, I mean, there's not a lot really happening in the winter, so I'm happy enough just to 
Need some soldiers soon. Yeah, I think so. Access goods need to be moved to a storehouse from, from where? Okay, I actually can take these people out of the farmhouse because they're not doing anything at all. Um, I can put another family on this forester hut. guys planting trees here uh, and I need these guys to stop cutting down those trees so I'm gonna just limit their work area and let's get them over here clearing these trees so I can build another field or extend this field up further February so the snow is about to start thawing and uh, we made it through another winter, guys. We're nearly we're nearly into the second year. Very, very close here. Oh, paused it. So close. I can almost taste it. That dream my dream, but it's the climb. I've got one more year until I need soldiers, definitely. Um, because there will be a militia. I can form a militia at any point, I'm pretty sure. None of stable space? Of course there is. That's not even there's not even anything in there. Bandit camp sighted. Uh clay, berry, wild animals. Don't know where. Just there. Same place it always has been. new message should we track them three hundred and sixty five days until the attack okay well we've got sixty nine We've got 69 settlers, that is, um, it's pretty good, I mean, okay, so I need to think about building some more houses soon as well. Um, because they're full now. But also, I do need to level these ones up. What requirements aren't met here? Fuel stall supply. Two types of food. We definitely, definitely seems like we're running a bit low on shit then.
Still got loads of firewood. Can level these ones up. Okay, um, I do have two sheep now as well. What do I, what do, I do with it? How do I shear it? I wonder if I assign a couple of families to the farmhouse again, will they shear the sheep? Oh, they're, they're plowing again. Hope so. out here. Oh, I'm getting a call. Give me one second.
Where am I? Thanks. <laughs> if you weren't in the chat, I would have just been sat here <laughs> talking Thought to myself. I was tripping for a sec. No, sorry. LMAO. I, uh... I can't even remember what I was talking about now. Anyway, back in business. Um... Why are they plowing this field again? Ah, uh, there's nothing even... Nothing grey on them. Is anything being built there? I don't think so. A logging camp was finished, wasn't it? Um. Well, we actually need a family on it. Cover. And get them on these trees. still pretty low uh, definitely doing better for food can I level up any of these houses upgrade to level 2 yeah upgrade to level 2 yeah upgrade Upgrade. And then I want a permanent livestock there. Um, actually, I should have been ordering one of these every month. That's, that's fucking stupid that I haven't been doing that. There's some body on this field. Right. Uh we got some people log in. What doesn't have anyone? A forager hut, that's okay. Hunting camp doesn't have anyone. They now need a tavern supply. So, I need someone to make ale. I think that's where these guys come in. What are they doing? Granary and farmer. That's two families. I think I just need to go for a single family household. What are these people doing? 
foresters. Okay, yeah. Okay, berries are growing. Let's get them out of there. Um, Taking the loggers. Actually, I need a family for construction. Actually, I need a couple of families for construction, to be honest. Uh, we got th three in the woodcutters. Demand for firewood is going to be going down, surely, so let's get three more builders. Got no one on that log cutter camp, someone in the storehouse. Got one person in the tannery. Let's take one of the farmers. Right, and then that gives us a few builders. I don't know where to build my next houses either. Actually, I can probably build another one just here. Needs to be as compact as possible if you're gonna build a wall. Yeah, well, I'm I'm trying to. That's what I'm trying to do. Trying to keep it all around this kind of area. Don't want to go too far out, but obviously I do need fields. And I guess the manor could go here or just here next to the church. another house in here maybe Squeeze another rehouse on here at the end. Too small. That should be enough. Artisan workshops can sometimes produce multiple types of goods. To select what is being produced, check the general tab in the building panel. Um, okay. Some more sheep in, possibly. Um, oh, 
I wish I knew what the thresholding priority was. I don't know. I'm thinking I can build smaller houses here, but like multiple of them, possibly. Your hut. No reason not to move forward your hut just like over here. That's out of the way. further back and then Gotta let the animals fully get up as well. Right, so now I should definitely be able to buy s build build a load of houses here. Okay, that's a lot of burgage plots, but like you say, we have to try and conserve the space that we've got. Time. 
I don't understand. Again, so let's get that forager hut constructed. rush for these to be built either because um, I've got no food at the minute. So actually I'm going to stop them from being built. Let's collect those berries. These guys are just planting trees. Stop planting trees for now. We need you hunting. garden as well. We'll Unsigned families needed for construction work yet. Yeah, I, I don't want families doing construction work just at the moment. Too many resources need gathering. Um, it's berry harvest time. So they're seasonal. I think they grow through spring and summer so we can't let them get depleted so that they can recover. At least I'm hoping that's what's going to happen. So let it drop down to like 32 is halfway. Oh, they're, they're growing again. Two hundred and ninety nine days until the raiders arrive. That field's plowed, it's being sowed. That field's plowed, it's being sowed. This field is being plowed. Okay, we've got two unassigned families. What, what can we put them onto? The farm. 
We've got two doing logging. Loggers can't find anything. Clear those trees over there. I don't have any stone cutters at the moment. Still have 42 stone though. Anything not have anyone on it. No one building that because there's no families available. But I kind of do want to finish building this one. Laughing face. Do, do, do. And speed up time a little bit. See where we get up to. Time we on nearly twelve thirty. Jeez, getting late. anything to make bread with either. I don't have any crops. So how do I make rye? Does rye come from the wheat? Threshed wheat wheat threshed into grain. What the heck's rye then? Windmill. No, that's flour. Doing for berries two four six. 
WTF is RYH. RHY. Re. Rye? Yeah, I don't know. I can't grow it. So why... Why is it there? I, I can't seem to grow it. I can't grow in my fields. And... I can't create it. Do you need it? I don't know. I don't think so. But it's just one of the things that's fertile for me, rye. It's the most fertile thing, but there's no... I think emmer might be wheat, you know? Emmer fertility, I think that's like the wheat fertility, but I can't grow, I can't grow rye. For whatever reason. Anyway. Here's what it is. Um... Yeah, everyone's doing Maybe something. Maybe you have to unlock it later. Yeah, possibly. Yeah, these guys are out hunting. What's the fucking population at? 12. Okay, yeah. No, keep hunting. You're good. You're good, you're good, you're good. Well, my approval rating's pretty good. Um, we need the good morale for a militia, which we will eventually get around to. Uh, how are we doing for logs? Okay, so... I can unassign someone from somewhere. What are these guys all doing? Right. Crops are growing. And this is being ploughed by that ox. So, I got some spare people. Let's get this ship built. So it looks like I'm going to get a harvest this year. And I've also built a um, sheep farm. Or I'm building a sheep farm. Okay, sheep farm built. Got a new family and we can get some more stone. And get some more logging done. Um I still got people making firewood, that's fine. I can ramp that up at the end of the year if I have to. Uh, okay. Where are we up to? 
What was I doing? Trading post. Yeah, just checking why I never have any fucking eggs. Berries are still growing. We're still harvesting them. That's good. Don't harvest them too fast that we don't want to lose them all. Um, they're sowing this field. That one's sown. I got one family unassigned. Still 12 wild animals there. I wonder if I could fit that there without this stable being here. It's not even got anything attached to it. Actually, put a hitching post back behind it. We do have one family available to uh, help with that. So, what I do need to do is build another wee logging camp over here I think because I'm gonna need to start building like windmills and shit um so yeah I'm gonna do that I'm gonna build a logging camp and I need an area for the manor as well which maybe over here that's quite close to the road so maybe somewhere here and then we'll wall around this bit of the city Four trees. What the heck? Where else I can put it? No. Really not. Anywhere. Four. But I am going to demolish the one that I'm not using. Is this one still being used? Yeah. Demolish this one. Going to see Civil War tomorrow. Um, looking forward to that. Should be good. 
heard good things about it. Heard it's very um, cinematography is very good in it. So. Switching to Marphone BRB. No worries, bro. I appreciate you for I appreciate you sticking around so late. Don't feel like you have to. Done. Um. Get one family into the tavern. We got a new ox on the way. Production of clothes. Yeah, let's do that. Construction finished on that logging camp. Let's get these guys from here over to here and they can get login let's see up here I'm glad the game auto saves as well because I just forget to save it all the time so good that there's the uh, auto save feature We got the tavern. Okay, by these fields, we're gonna have to do our farming works. Um, so we definitely need a need a windmill, and a communal oven would be good as well.
I don't really know if I want to take up that space because it could be for fields. Can I get it here? Yep. I'll do it. And a road to it. One second. I had one beer. <laughs> one beer stashed outside. We uh, just going easy tonight. Just having one or two. Cheers. Um, Madri. A good beer. Anyway. Back to the game. Uh, we've got our windmill on the way. We still got woodcutters. Do we still have people out hunting? Hopefully. Okay, so animals are recovering at the moment. Um, I feel like this piece of land is not claimed. There's berries up here. I want to try something. If I sign someone to the forager hut, right? And I set their work area to up there. Will that work? Can I do that? Yes, I can. Okay, well, go collect me some berries. Growth rate about twenty eight percent. Windmill is on the way, um, and I think I will actually put it there eventually. You know that windmill. Uh, I could, I could put down another field. This is my best spot for barley here. Definitely grow some more barley. Ah, oh, fuck it, yeah. Why not? I don't know if there's a downside to, to doing this. Flax can be weaved into linen, but I need barley to make beer. So, I've got two barley fields. Let's get this sorted. And do I still have an ox sign assigned there? Yes, I do. Well, I don't think the family will actually be doing anything there. They'll, uh... The ox will probably go and do it all. some herbs um, well they're not going out there but why don't I try sending them I'm gonna 
gonna try sending them up here. No, there's no berries. building. Okay. That's kind of good to know, I guess. start building more huts. I love him comes full. W. W is right, sir. Um You gonna be streaming this again? Yeah, I think so, man. Would you be interested in watching me stream it again? Yee. Yeah, appreciate that, man. Thank you. Uh, yeah, I am definitely going to be streaming this again. Um, I think I'm going to be streaming it quite often, to be fair. I don't, I mean, I'm, I feel like I'm going to be playing this game a lot, so why not just stream while I'm playing it? It's kind of, it's kind of how I'm looking at it at the moment. So, uh, yeah, I, I definitely will be streaming this game again. May as well. Yeah, exactly. Um, I've got nothing to use at the windmill for yet, so there's no point in putting anyone there. Him and Ruth. Being claimed by who? Aren't you gonna get attacked soon? Yeah, I am in 209 days. That's why I'm trying to get more people living in my living in my place. Who is this being claimed by? There's no one there. Because I want it. I've got livestock, I don't really know what I can do with them though. Um, so, I've got wool now, so I can... I can produce yarn. I'm already producing leather. Uh, barley to produce malt. I don't have any clay yet, I don't have any iron. Uh, so, barley to produce malt. So I'm gonna need that soon as well. Yeah, that's that's being claimed still. But but who, who buy? This the this guy's. I feel like I need to. Uh, I don't know. I don't feel like I can do that yet. I don't think I have enough. Strength to do that. I 
I don't think the attack from the raiders is going to be too extreme. And I can form a militia. So, what have I got? Spears. The male villagers will be evenly distributed be between all militia units. They will then try and find the required equipment. The weapon and shield depends on the unit type, while the maximum quality of body armor and helmet depends on the villagers' residential level. After bringing all the necessary equipment home, the unit recruits are marked as ready to rally. Only then will you be able to rally your, your, your unit. Shit. I'd to spam. Right, so I don't need I don't need them yet, so I can disband them all. But yes, that's how I do it. How can I get more berries? I got two points here. As can well. you not train a few proper soldiers? I can hire them. WB archers. Yeah, you can get archers. Um, but I don't have any bow and arrows. But I can hire mercenaries. But I don't have any money in the treasury yet, so I can't afford to yet. But I, that is like that is something I can do. Uh, once I have a manor, then I can start collecting taxes and shit, so... You need a Fletcher's, I think. Fletcher's? Where is that? They make bows. Yeah, but where is that? Do I need to... IDK. <laughs> Me either, bro. That's armor making. That's mining. Forest management. That was all capacity of berry deposits. That's not a bad one. And the honey one. Orchard tree is not a bad one as well, like some apples. Um, and the sheep multiplying. Because I've already got sheep. Oh, I know individual houses Fletcher's workshop yeah okay I know that's good I think I I think ah oh. I think it's useful I think that would be useful to nice have. I think I need yarn as well which I can do. Okay, let's let's do that then. Um, yarn. So I've got wool. So I want to make yarn. That'll be an industry. Here, weavers workshop. Oh, nice! I can just stick a. It's, it's only little.
This is a proper wee town. Like, this is so cool. I'm gonna take a walk around in a sec. Yeah, that's perfect there. Imagine this with a VR mod, and I could walk around this city and this town in VR that I built <laughs> with my own hands. No, that would be sick. And the thing is about this game, like, you know, this is, this game, it's new, it's just come out. Um, it's just come out today, so this is, like, we're discovering this all together, you know, we're the ones creating the tutorials how to do things. This is us. Like, this, uh, us watching this. Us watching this and playing this. We're the ones discovering the game and learning how to play it. And we're the ones that are going to be making the tutorials and, and talking about how to play this game. Uh, so, you know, I'm, what, five hours into this game now? And this is what we've done in five hours. Which I think is pretty good. Um, it's pretty, It's I think it's a pretty decent achievement what, we, what, we, what we've managed here in the last five hours. Uh, and the good thing is, like, I don't feel like I've been playing this game for that long. But it's 1am, so I have been playing it for that long. And I'm just like, I'm sitting here thinking, fuck, when's the next time? I get to play this game. And it's going to be Sunday. I will be back on on Sunday. And probably during the week at some point as well. Fire. So what are we up to here? We're just... Uh we got the Weaver's Workshop on the way, and the Fletcher's Shop as well. Not that Logan camp's full. That's okay. Because that one's not. That means these guys... Well, actually... I gotta keep these guys in the market still. Let's get another family as a woodcutter there. So Fletcher Arch Shop. Dom, cat DJ. <laughs> uh, Fletcher Shop is done, but. How does it work? Don't understand that. Yeah, how do I... Is there no Fletchers? Um, nothing on miss out, nothing on, so like, there's definitely, there's definitely a lot of this missing, do you know what I mean, there's, there's stuff here. I'm wondering, like, has some of this stuff just been 
add it in quickly. You know, shit like this takes time, obviously. Um, has this all been done just very quickly, kind of last minute, just to get it ready for release? And obviously we're waiting on more of this. Um, one thing I am kind of hopeful for is that... Ah, here we go. We just need planks. Okay, I take it back. It's uh, obviously been quite well thought out. Uh, so I apologize for saying that. That it was an afterthought. But I didn't mean it in a bad way. I was just wondering, you know, was it something that, w that was kind of just left to the last minute? Um... I'm hoping this is going to be a good harvest. Oh nice, we got another family in. So where have we got people? I think what I do want to do right now, I don't know how much longer I'm going to stay on for, but uh, definitely. So they but just automatically make a bow if there's a plank. Yeah, it seems that way. Oh shit. I'm gonna... I'm just gonna go back to those tunes out. Oh no, well actually. If I I'm this... ahead to bed soon. Yeah, fair enough. Um... Never mind. I gotta keep the in game music on because we're streaming. Um, and we don't want the stream to be muted. So, just gotta do what we gotta do. We just uh, stick with the in game music, which actually is, it's okay. So brewery still can't do anything because we don't have malt yet. It's banging. Yeah, it's good, isn't it? So, um, let's see. They've got some planks, have they? Oh yeah, there we go. They made some booze. Right, our population's eighty-three. Can we make it to a hundred by the end of the night? G's rapid. Yeah, can we make it to 100? Possibly. I would need a couple more burgage plots, but... You'll not find anywhere else. We can maybe, I don't know, we can maybe find somewhere here to tuck some more in. Um, just down the back here. I don't think we need any more fields, so... If we do wall this city, we could wall, it out, we could wall the fields outside it. They don't need to be walled inside the city, I don't think. Um, that could be like a the next the next step. But I'm just thinking if I, but I don't have the food. I don't have the food. I can't. I gotta wait and see how my harvest goes. That ox has taken forever to do that field. I can only have one livestock. Which is annoying. I wonder would it get done faster if I unassigned that. And put a load of people on it. Pro probably not, to be fair.
Don't even need those people on it anyway. Um, we need some berries. I think that much is fair to say. We need some more food. Uh, resources are low when it comes to the wild animals. But these berries over here are very enticing. The only thing is, is there's a bandit camp right there. But I think we could take them. So I'm considering expanding here and exporting these berries. Oh, I don't have the money. I need a, I need money for a settlement camp, I'm pretty sure. So I can't actually do that. Okay, well, I need a manor then. I think that might be the next thing I have to build. Require settlement level, small village. Huh? Is this my manor? Does it matter where I put it really? I think pro- I mean I would kind of like it on the hill. But this is kind of obstructing it. Oh well, I'm gonna put it on the hill. This is as far as we're extending, you know? Castle Planner, let's go! Fucking Castle Planner, baby! <laughs> gang, gang, we are into the Castle Planner. Listen to me, do you hear what I'm saying? It's Castle Planner time. Listen, let's go. If uh, playing this game and streaming at the same time has taught me anything, it's that I need a new friggin' CPU. It's on the it's on the list next month. I'm gonna buy it after payday. Um, maybe I should make a make a goal. I would have to have people watching me first though. <laughs> okay, this is a work in progress feature. Here you can edit the layout of your castle and plan the construction of new wings and of towers. When you press commit. The old layout will disappear and the new one will be constructed. For now, the cost is also fixed. Got it. 2020 gift. Thanks, mate, for the 2020 gift. <laughs> uh, okay. So... I need to place a road at least. Um. Yeah, I think that's a good place to put it. I mean, ideally, it would be in the middle. I probably should have thought about this a bit better, kind of where the market is, but or where the tavern is, to be fair. But anyway, this is where we have the most space, so... Okay, so first things first, we got a wall in the castle. What's the circle around it? I have no idea. Right, let's see. We'll start off with some small walls. So we move that logging camp. Forty six planks, no, that's too big. But 
34 planks. I'm trying not to... Oh yeah, there we go. Stop it from bending. Alright. That'll do for now, for the walls. See, I think I might have put this in the wrong place. Is this not supposed to be a protect me? But it'll, but it'll also protect my village, won't it? So... Let's see, can I add one of these towers? There, see, now this is protecting more of the village. So I can extend this wall out around the whole town. But for now... For now, we just do it like this. All right. So now we're just protect. For now, we're just protecting the manor, and uh, the circle is obviously the space that's protected by by your defenses. Makes sense. Okay. So the next goal then is to get the whole city walled off. Um, and protected with towers. Which is going to take a lot of resources. So. We need to get more people into the city. But we need more food. And we don't have more food until the fields are done. And once the fields are done then we need to build some ovens. Uh, to, to cook bread. So. Are we are we reducing yarn here? Well, they've got wool. I assume they're producing yarn. Um, we got five warbos in there. We got one roll of yarn. Sixty-two. Right. Okay. We've got quite a lot. We have got some tools and everything in there. Spears, shields. Okay. In terms of our logging camps, that one's full. This one is also full, so we can pull these people out of here. To be honest, we can get rid of this logging camp. Because those resources are going to be used up anyway. And realistically, we don't want to we don't want to get rid of these trees too much more because they're kind of providing us some sort of protection from any um, from any enemies we could get coming from this way. Uh, obviously, we do have a little base out here for the stone cutters, um, but these trees are, are, I feel like they're kind of important to provide us some protection from anyone that would attack us, you know, come down this way through to here. Um, we really want to avoid that, so that's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to leave these trees here for now, uh, whilst my manor is being built. So we've gone for a small manner to start with, but, um, you know, we'll protect the church uh, as we extend out, and each time we'll extend a little bit further. But, um, as I say, we just Can need they come through the trees? Uh, yeah, they can come through the trees. They can. But I'll know. I'll know before they um, make it out, you know? Before they get to this point, I'll know that they're already in my area. But the, the, the issue is now, I'm surrounded by the other lord. So I need to, I need to start making a move. I need to fucking move into this one, because that gives me a central location. So he probably is going to come at me in that central location from everywhere. But as soon as I can start collecting some taxes, then I can start collect earning money um so that i can build a settlement camp so this is the highest priority we got six families available for building so it should be done in no time like oh shit
Nice. Okay, what do I do? I need to build a well. OMG. What the fuck? Well. Yeah, I need to build a well. Um, I also need to create a new save game. I don't want to fucking go out now. Oh, man. Okay, uh... Yeah, a well, um, for water. For water to put out the fire. Everyone that's assigned to anything. Let's just get people unassigned here so that um, they can come help us. GNA have to in a min. Gonna have to go in a minute. Uh, that is all good, bro. I appreciate Sleep. you. Lol. Yeah, that's okay. I'm gonna have to go soon as well. Um, I appreciate you sticking with me this late, man. I've uh, really enjoyed this game so far. And uh, I appreciate you sticking with me this late. Um, you didn't have to stay this late, so... Many thanks. Uh, let's see if we can get another well in here anywhere. GG's been good. Yeah, no worries, Sick mate. game. It's a great game. I'll uh, hopefully catch you on Sunday when I'm playing again. Night. Good night, mate. Sounds good. Okay, the fire ended. Um, don't know what happened there. We gotta rebuild up. It must have been the, uh, the storm. Alright, where do we need people back again? One of the forest is hot. Granary. Cousin Cam still got people in it. Warehouse. Granary. Farmhouse. Trading post. So one saw pit. Got a horse in. Church. I don't know what's going on there. There is a clothing store. Maybe it's because I don't have any linen. How do I make linen?
flax. I don't have any flax at all. Like maybe buy some in. some flax in then. Um, and then it'll be the weaver's workshop. Hopefully that works then. To make some linen. And that will improve the linen of this one. I think the main issue is there's not a high enough supply of those materials. So the tannery as well we kind of need. Do I have hide? Welcome if you've just tuned in. This is a very fun game. I'm uh, really, really enjoying it, to be honest. Um, the tunes, they got me dancing as well. But, uh, listen, let's get these guys working anywhere. We do need to maybe start getting some more logs in soon, but not quite just yet. Um, how's this going? Okay. Clearly time for some harvest in then. We still need one family at least doing the uh construction work. We've got eighty nine people now in the town. Construction finished on a new clothing stall as well. Um, well, that meets the approval for this house then. Great. That's a real bonus. Oh, shit. Okay, hold on. Um, so my exposed stocks are getting wet. Where do I store them? It must be like a grain shed or something. Let 
Let's see. Farmhouse. the grain stored. Should I have multiple farmhouses? I don't think so. Granary. Mm. Store. Pack station. Hitching post? No. So I don't know what it means by my stocks are getting wet then. I don't think there's really anything I can do about that. low priority that one I can't move anything from the storehouse So every home is occupied. Thirty families. Thirty-two spaces. Hmm, okay. These guys need another food supply, uh, another food stall. This is this is all the barley that I'm gonna be getting this year, I think. We need to be threshing that wheat now as well. Although to be fair, it's not a high priority just yet. If it's in if it's in the farmhouse. doesn't need to be a high priority really um, I want to get this built I don't really know where I can take people from I 
I'll take one of the foresters. Still going, what a goat. Yes, bro, still here. <laughs> uh, I've been playing this for like five hours now. How was your stream? Your uh, raid train. I hope it went well. I mean, look at my town. We're even farming right Nutty. now. Popped off. Ah, oh, shit, yeah, I love that. Did you get many in? Bet you had quite a few. Hope you did, anyway. I wonder... Am I selling any flax? I don't know. Did I get any flax? Yeah, decent. Average 23 viewers. Yes. Inside. I love that. Didn't mean to do that. I was looking for a. I was looking for a good sound reaction there, but I. Do, I don't have anything really. Stop it, Rod. Stop. Just, just all What's the soundboard from when I. So far, then. Man, it's this is fucking awesome. This game. Seriously. I've been playing it for five hours, and uh, I I'll happily continue playing for longer. I think it's even been more than five hours. I think <laughs> I think my my time's just frozen. Um, but the thing is, like, I'm gonna be sitting playing this anyway. This is what I was saying to uh, Arknade. Like, I, I'm gonna be sitting playing this anyway. So why not just stream it? W whether anyone's here or not doesn't really matter. To be fair, because I'm gonna be playing it either way. The only difference is I'm going to be sat here chatting to myself instead. <laughs> um, but yeah, no man, it's really good. It's really engaging. Uh, you know, there's there's a strategy to it. You build your houses. Um, you get your families in. We've now got 30 families, 90 people here. Uh, and we got 32 houses. So, you know, I built a church. Built a, the town square around the church. and then Half that's so fair. Makes sense about gaming TBH. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, it does make sense. Um, got got the tavern here, but we don't have any beer yet. These guys are going to be making the beer. But we have to get the barley and stuff first, so... Been doing some farming. Got some wheat here. Um, and we've actually finally got some grain as well, which we can get into the windmill. Get that turning. Gemma, this game is really good. Uh, I've thoroughly enjoyed playing it so far, so I'm 100% uh, I'm going to be playing loads more of it because it's as good as I'd hoped, and I haven't even gotten like I haven't even gotten very far into it. I'm only on my halfway, nearly ha about halfway through my second year now. So I started in spring, so I'm about halfway through the second year. Um, in 129 days, there are people, there's going to be a battle, so, yeah, plenty, plenty more to come. I'm currently building my manor, so the, my first manor, obviously, because it's manor lords, that makes sense. Um, building the first manor so that we can get some taxes, get some money in, and then start expanding and hiring, like, mercenaries and stuff if we need to do any battles, so... Just a wee small manner for now. Um, I don't really know the kind of process because 
Well, I just haven't really seen anyone talk about it yet. So, I'm just going to build a small one. And then I think I can probably extend the walls and stuff. So, we'll start by, like, I don't know, maybe protecting the church or, you know, we'll, we'll do, like, an area at a time. Um, until then, we have the whole city walled in. Uh, it's getting a bit getting a bit tight now, though, so I'm going to build some more houses here, I think. Um, you got to do some good field rotation as well. So I don't know whether to expand my fields up this way or not. Uh, but next year we're using every Looks field. Looks very chill. Yeah, man, it is very chill. You're going to use every field then next year to... For like we're not we're not gonna take a year out of any of these fields. Um Is this still growing? I feel like I need to I feel like I need to harvest the rest of this stuff. Getting this plowed. Getting it plowed. It's November. I feel like I need to start harvesting this. Or it's gonna die. Just had a look on the page to see who else was streaming this and Jericho is. That's kinda mad. Yeah, um I'm telling you this game. This game has the potential to be fucking game of the year when it's finally released. It's that good. I've, I'm enjoying it that much. There's been a... It's been a while since I've found a game like this that I can just sink my teeth into and just, like, play for ages. And this is this is the one. Oh yeah, Jericho is streaming this with 796 viewers. Quality. rare these days isn't it yeah you're right it really is it is rare uh, especially feels rare that I would find something that I like that much as well you know um, we had a bit of an issue there getting our fields all plowed because they're not gonna be Grain and flour. Um, have we got some barley now? So I need to make malt with the barley, and then that can go on and become beer. So I need one of these. I'm so bad for playing single player games because I need constant action, I think but enjoyed Star Wars Jedi Survivor and Hogwarts Legacy recently. Yeah, uh, I played Hogwarts Legacy recently as well and really enjoyed it. Um, it had been a while since I played a single player game because I've just kind of mostly played um, like online games recently, you know, like FIFA and NHL and shit, so... Yeah. Nice to have something like this that I can just fucking chill out, have a couple of beers, just just relax and play. Uh, no big deal, you know. Fucking hell, this manor's taking ages to build. nearly there though. I just don't have enough people living here at the moment. But everywhere's full. I need to... Uh, I had a fire before as well. Um, December, we're heading into the winter now.
Uh, Star Wars Jedi Survivor, though. I played the first Jedi game. Um, but haven't... I haven't played the most recent one. Right. No more working on the farm. Second one was better. Second one was better. I'll have to give it a go then. Maybe, maybe I First just... was good, but second was elite. Okay, fair enough. Um, yeah, well, maybe I just didn't give it enough, enough of a chance. First one was okay. I just haven't, I haven't played the second one at all, so I wouldn't have a clue if it's good or not. Think it's coming to Game Pass, actually. Okay. Yeah, I got PC Game Pass, so I'll maybe give that a go. I hope we have enough food to get us through the winter, man. It's gonna be tight, for sure. Construction finished on the new well. And I need to build a communal oven as well. Space the right way in this game. I love the construction here as well. That's the malt house done. Be a late one tonight. Don't know, mate. Uh, I wasn't going to stay on so late as, as long as I am, but um, I don't know, I'm still feeling good. Maybe a little bit. I'll see to be fair, like just see, just see how I get on. Although I am kind of hungry, so maybe I'll just order some food soon and head off. I'm definitely going to play some more on uh, Sunday. I'm about on Sunday, so I'll probably play some more on Sunday. But I just I don't I don't want to stop playing. Nice one. Well, we had a hundred people. That was the goal for tonight. Let's just hit that save. Uh, oh, that was when I had the fire. Saved it in case I didn't know I didn't figure out how to stop the fire quick enough. Barley out. Down to the malt house. So we can start getting some beer made. I need to grow some flax after the winter. Uh, and I 
actually down here has the best fertility that's close to me, so I'm gonna put a field here for flax. Split it in two actually. Definitely going to go off before I get to the battle. Could be time to build some more houses once we're through the winter as well. Still have a stone cutter for I totally forgot about them. They've just been out there working away. This tavern supply is good. We gotta upgrade the church. Need clay. See, that's where we have to start expanding out here to get some clay. I've also got no money. There's not much I can do right now other than survive. fields here as well. I don't know if I have a manpower for to do this like
Let's go for a reflux. Because I need that flex. Okay. I got one family unassigned. What are they doing? Is every business and stuff got its assignments? I got 10 sheep in there. No one in the sheep farm, but don't need anyone in the sheep farm right now. Tavern. Alright. I think that is a good point to leave it, leave it for now. Um, wow, that has been very, very fun. Thoroughly enjoyed that. Alrighty, my man. That was good. That was good. Uh, I'll be back on Sunday again. Thanks for tuning in. Um, and uh, yeah, that was good. I've thoroughly enjoyed Enjoy that. Enjoy so food. I will. I will. I so will. Anyway, good night. I'll catch you later.